so uh, last session, you guys uh, cleared out and finished up the uh, temple. Talked to uh, Kahobi Bryant. Bryant. Uh, <laughs> and uh, he told you uh, a bunch about Warble and how he had come back and taken the piece that you were here to get. And then you saw the ship leaving. And you were like, oh, fuck. We've been scammed. Yay! And, and you walked outside, and uh, you were like, okay, let's take some rests. Let's, get, let's collect ourselves, and maybe we'll go after them. You guys got some rest. And you woke up the next day, and you said goodbye to uh, one of your companions, uh, Splark, Splash Spark. She basically said that she had some sort of greater purpose here. You guys said goodbye to the lizard folk, uh, and you were given uh, a suggestion, uh, some advice by uh, their leader, and uh, then you left uh, towards the beach where someone had remembered that there was a trident uh, who ro ra rose raised raised um, hippocampi hippocampi yeah exactly so you helped her out you made a deal you killed an evil fae that was fucking with her herd uh, and she offered you a horn to summon triton, uh, not to summon tritons. No, to, to summon the hippocampi, was it? Hippocampi. Yeah. Uh, and also do like a bunch of other things. And then she also gave you each a hippocampi, like a real one. Not one that could be summoned and then would leave in like an hour. Uh, so, uh, we pick up about then. Uh, what do you guys plan on doing? Well, after the the son of a bitch that uh, left us. Well, because I have reread and relearned, oh, wait, I need to do certain things, uh, I'm going to uh, just right now fix things and take a point of burn to have my shield attuned. Okay. Uh, it, so, so, so we're, uh, we're, we're picking up basically directly from where we left off? Yep. Uh, I think. Uh, Cone will turn to Last Snow and say, Now, considering the situation that we picked you up in, uh, we offered you passage off the island. Now, it appear well, our situation has changed significantly, and the four of us will gesture to the rest of the group, have a personal interest in chasing down those pirates. Now, I would not want to enlist you in a uh, in a job if you're if you have no personal stakes in the matter. So, do you care to join us on our trip to see if Laurenti will keep their word to us? Well, as old allies, I'm keen to see this through with you. Well, as as you said, I was shipwrecked, so it's not like I had much else going for me. <laughs> well, I appreciate I... you'd say that, considering the state we left you in. Welcome to the team again. Thank you. Now, if we are again keen to take off, I would very much like to be healed some more. It still hurts. Oh um, yes, of course. Can I? Yeah, I could probably treat critical wounds. Yeah. Well, that, that only works on a rest, doesn't it? Does it? I thought that just meant you healed I extra. I don't know. I uh, you could are. you could treat deadly wounds. Uh, it is a DC twenty if you have a healer's kit or surgical tools, and uh, DC twenty five if you don't. And it's a heal check, and then they heal equal to their level. Uh. Or I, I guess actually how many hit dice they have, which is normally their level. Uh, and uh, plus your wisdom mod or intelligence mod if you beat it by five. 
Uh, so I don't have my healer's kit. You should. I think you should have a healer's kit because I yeah. believe that it was part of the gift that was given to you by the lizard folk when you became a part of their tribe. Oh, oh let me scroll down. Uh, uh, a person to cure moderate wounds. Javelin lightning turtle shell. Was it not? I do not see it, but if it was, I'll write it down now. I think I'm wrong, actually. No. I think I was mixing up the potion to cure moderate wounds. Unless you weren't. Unless they give us both. No, I was wrong. I'm okay. wrong right now. <laughs> Fair enough. Uh, yeah, I'll try. It does, it does happen occasionally. Unbelievable. Yeah, oh, does anyone else want to help me heal last now? Patch him up? Uh, I think my heal isn't bad. Yeah, you can aid. Anyone can aid. And it doesn't give him any penalty if you fail. Uh, it's not a skill that requires you to have ranks in it. Heal. Uh, I think while that would ha while that's happening, uh, Tone would would uh, confirm the details with Triton. Uh, heavy, will you help? Um. Sure, I can try to help. I've got a plus four. Hey. Easy. What details? Uh, well, specifically, uh, what do we, would you, would you come along with us? How would we return the, uh, the Hippocampi to you? Or is this a permanent transfer? They are yours. You Damn. have helped me out a lot. I, I appreciate this. Well, I don't need any more help from you. And but the gesture is... The gesture is sincerely appreciated, then. We will treat them as our own. Thank you. Because they are yours. I mean, uh, you can set them free, but... Hopefully, we can... We, we, we should be able to do that soon. We'll see. I mean, they are animals. So you can keep them if you want them. <laughs> if you could sell them. Yes. Right. Oh, uh, what's, what's the result on that heel check? Uh, 17. I got a 2. That is not very good. So that will fail. Now, uh, uh, is that... Oh, did you include the plus 4 bonus from that? Yes, I, I also cast guidance on myself. Dang. So that was awesome. You shouldn't have been able to do that. So it's actually a 16. Okay, well, I... okay. How long, how, how long does it take to... It takes an hour to treat deadly ones. Whoa! Okay, yeah! Yeah, I, I thought it was 10 minutes up until... Like just, we're talking uh, just today, minutes. actually, this morning. I mean, okay. are we? Uh, well, I have like we... a potion. If you like, really need it. D oh no, I got spells? a potion. I'm just, I'm not. Yes, but I, I, wanna, use... I, have like, I have one thing of Kimara. If if we're rushing across the river on Hippopant Campi, I would rather not be at nearly half health. Mm -hmm. But yeah, like probably if we're trying a good to choice. Just, Fair yeah. enough. If we're just trying to get to the island before them and set up an ambush, maybe I can wait. But if they're we're trying are, to I'm, rush the ship... I'm pretty sure they're already there. Or no, I, I remember we, the no, times... We, we beat them. No. With, the, with these hippocampi, we beat them. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, it would be know. less no, than a day we in the world. We took an entire night to rest when they left. Yeah, but it would take them, what, a... Two days? No, it would take oh. us three days on a rowboat. It would take yeah. them less than a day on a boat. Uh, like it their would take boat. them 12 hours is what you... Yeah, yeah they're basically, they're already, they are already there. there. Yeah. They're already... Oh, okay, so... We're playing yeah, catch I'd... up. We, have a, we know the general idea of where they want to go next. Yeah, and if and the whole the whole point was that if, if in fact, if, in fact, we arrive at the spot, the lat, the, their, their location... Uh, and they're not there, then Tone has a spell that can track the ship. Yeah, that that exactly. crack the ship. Well, then, I mean, I could just uh, use my potion I'll, I'll instead cure, of wasting time. I'll just time. cure moderate for you. Oh, perfect. So, 12. Not great. But it's up. Uh, that's close to full. I can I can do that for now, and then we can take off. Yeah. yeah, let's. I also have going. I have a lot of spare potions because I usually don't get hit that much in combat. I can give you. Uh, I have three cure light potions, so I can give you two of those if you want. 
Um, I'm good for now, but I may take okay. one later. I, okay. I tend to be squishy, as yeah. you guys have noticed. Yes. <laughs> Little stress ball. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so you guys set out on Hippocampi back. Uh, you, uh, uh, Genesar will uh, sort of teach you guys how to climb into these saddles. Uh, they're really tight to the animal because it's uh, part horse, part fish. The fish scales are like really slippery. Uh, and uh, you have to be tied into uh, the uh, harness properly. Uh, so, uh, do any of you have ride trained? Uh, uh, I do. No. Uh, that is a no. It is a class skill, but I have no ranks in it. Same, oh, and I've got a minus one from armor. Oh, I guess I have no ranks in it either, so that would be a no. Oh, okay. Uh, in that case, uh, you're all sort of like uh, trying to figure this out. Apparently, you were all infantry or uh, archer. <laughs> I mean, Before, uh, yes. Encountered the uh, no cavalry here. The uh, collapse of the uh, company. Uh, I'm sorry. Do any of us look like cavaliers? You don't need to be a cavalier to be cavalry. I know. Ah, I should have ridden a ram. But that's the oh, that that's awesome. the thing. Like, that's the joke. Anyway. I do not understand the joke. Never mind. Uh, well, you guys are going to uh, climb on. Uh, she teaches you how to strap yourselves in. Uh, and then you set off. Uh, and these things clip across the surface of the water uh, at fast speeds. So we're traveling above the water, not under the water, correct? Yes. They're not ducking under the water to drown you. But they're mostly okay. underwater. Okay. Uh, and, uh, as you approach, uh, the direction that you know, Land Terry took the magpie princess, you see the ship ahead. It may have been laid somehow, uh, but it is not at the island yet. It is sailing close to, but it is several miles ahead of you. Do you see both of them enter your frame of vision? Both of them, uh, meaning the island and the ship. Yes. Okay. Um. Hmm. Uh, the question is: Do we cut them off, or do we wait for them at the island? Uh, the island. Uh, shows no sign of recent civilization. A thin beach of yellow sand circles most of the island, except where he's, where st steep gray crags jut from the sea. Bird songs echo constantly from a thick canopy that covers much of the island. The strangest feature is the black stone statue structure. Wow. Blackstone structure that rises from the water on the northeastern side, forming a jagged cliff whose surface and edges resemble a giant black coral reef. My the other, uh, I mean, tone. We could cut them off, or we could maybe circle around and get on the island before them or remain in out of sight? Um, I believe it'd be better to 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 go to the island first. Okay. Boarding could potentially be seen as aggressive. Yeah. Uh, now you said... But half my stuff's on there. I uh, want it back. The ship you see has uh, sort of landed uh, on one of the beaches nearby this structure that rises out. Oh, so they are at the island already. Uh, they they are eventually. Like you catch up with them as they're landing, and you're nearing as well. Okay. So they're only like twenty minutes ahead of you. Okay. Now, Tone, you said heartbreak 
contacted you with some spell or something. Yes. He didn't... I mean, if they want to pick us up, what's the harm in us? I mean, that's if we believe the heartbreak, I suppose. It I don't is know. If we believe this whole thing is just... Uh, it stinks. I believe... I believe that we should make our presence known and that trust can be repaired and that our presence here is merely security for ourselves. And if they have a problem with that, if they don't have a problem with that, then we don't have a problem with them. That seems simple enough, doesn't it? Well, the crew seemed to like us, so... I mean... I think that's a... That's a good idea. As much as I don't like what, what they've done to us, there's no need to, to get all aggressive like. Yes, let's hope. So, unless anyone has a issue, we'll meet them, we'll wait for them at the shore. I know none of the crew, so I leave it up to you. All right. If all if all goes well, let us know. Um, there won't be need for any conflict. All you need to know is that that crew is filled with good people that I would hate to be on the other end of a battlefield of. Mm. Uh, so yeah, I think we just head forward. I'm gonna head right up to the uh, ship. Not to the ship. We we would basically essentially try to wait for them on the beach. If we could. It if uh, not like approach the ship. Okay, but make yourself clearly visible. No, no. yeah, we're not trying to hide. Okay. Yeah. yeah. So you're gonna land on the beach next to them, essentially. Yeah, that works. Okay, but, but not, not not like try to like get up onto the ship. Understood. Uh, so you guys land uh, next to the ship. You can see people like little dots from Jesus far away. Fucking Christ! Who? What's going on? No, my cat fucking scared the shit out of me. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, get off that. Come on. Oh. Little dots? Oh my god. Here, oh here, god, here. it's not a swarm, I swear. <laughs> uh, so... Um, uh, you see... Yeah, what's I'm, on on old, I'm on the old page. Is that still a thing? Uh, no. Good point. Uh, there isn't actually a map for this part. Cool. Okay. Sorry. Continue. Put you in here. Huh? Forget the fuck. Oh yeah. <laughs> Tyler's doodles. <laughs> Weeks upon weeks of so edition. I didn't even see all that. <laughs> <laughs> we all forgot all about it. I forgot the French part. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot the text bubble part. What is he holding in his hand? A pizza. A pizza. It's Mountain Dew. I don't know why. Oh, it's, it's Mountain Dew. Mountain Dew. It's Mountain Dew. It's part of Mag Magpie's gourmet on the pizza. Bed. I forgot what that was. A what was yeah. Uh, I, think I remember the conversation. the conversation. I don't. I don't remember. <laughs> I remember the conversation. I don't exactly remember how we arrived at the conversation. I, I remember it now. I I remember like you know being over on like I think it was archives of Nethys or something, and then tabbing back into this and being like, "What the fuck?" <laughs> okay. <laughs> so. So they've landed uh, right by uh, a uh, a lo building lower on the ground, not built up into this crag. Uh, it is a black tower uh, that, from the peak of it uh, being like sort of lined with this like red glass, seems to have once perhaps been a lighthouse. Um. But it, it looks like it has been sort of overgrown uh, and it is not currently operated. Uh, the magpie princess, small rowboat is visible. Yeah, so they're anchored off the beach. A uh, small rowboat is visible on the beach, uh, dragged up to the edge of the jungle. 
uh, where a small trail leads into the vegetation. Uh, the uh, Horum Heb is going to uh, flash some symbols out as you guys land, essentially asking you to come over. To the ship or? Yeah, to the ship. Um, that is anchored away from the land. There's also a rowboat up near the jungle, just to be clear. Uh, is there anyone on land right now? Is not, that, that's not, that's not that you can see. Okay. I guess, I mean, if they're asking us to go on the ship, I mean... Yeah, it's either a trap or we're well, cool. Either they're fucking us or we're cool, and in which case, if we're getting fucked, I'd rather know it now than get fucked on land. Yeah. Uh, uh, I will. I will send my. Uh, I'll send my familiar because if they're close enough, I'll send. Uh, I'll send my familiar to deliver a spoken message. Oh, what we we established, it can de- oh, deliver a message like a carrier pigeon, uh, saying, uh, "We live, bitch." <laughs> no. <laughs> um. Uh, saying, we want security. One person from your crew on the boat, wow. like out on the on the on the rowboat. Uh, yeah. Um, Hormheb is gonna call him to lower a boat, but he's gonna lower himself down in it, and he's gonna start paddling over to you guys. Fair enough. Yeah. All right. Well, let's see what happens. And what do you think this is a bad idea? He will climb out once he reaches the beach, and he'll start walking over to you guys. Uh, And uh, he'll wave you down. And he says, uh, "Uh, It's good to see you all again. We did not expect to see you come here. Nor did we expect to find ourselves in this circumstance, yet here we are. Um, I, we wish to parlay with Laurenti uh, in, in good faith. Uh, uh, Laurenti is not here. Uh, Laurenti has traveled to, well, the temple. He points up to the massive black structure. Hello. Not the lighthouse but the larger one that like makes up like a crag like a mountain Who's she the went alone captain, then? i am i am the quartermaster the lieutenant so to speak you don't seem too perplexed by our presence here no i figured you'd find a way i warned her in fact uh tone will kind of smirk so you see the situation that we were forced into. I do. I hope you won't blame her. We've only know. known you for a short amount of time. I'd, I'd like an explanation. That's about it. I, I get it. I mean, this is a... You guys are extremely dangerous. But she's the one that hired us. I mean, we... Yeah. The job's a job. I'm... I'm not the one to, to go back on, on Look, a job like that. I like you folk, just to be clear. But uh-huh. we don't know who you are. I mean, we, some of us want to think we do, but... The captain was broken up about this, but she figured if you guys wanted to take everything you could take everything she didn't want that to happen fair enough i for one believe that a professional relationship built on fear is not one that i want to participate in anymore um well you should go talk to her you think so that would probably make things worse though no i don't (laughs) think it would she likes you folks She's a bit of an idiot. Uh, bad mouthing your captain, quartermaster. Uh, Toad will gotta give him another smile. At least I'm not killing them. <laughs> well, <laughs> uh, like well, someone. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> well, 
I at least have no intention. Oh, that's a reference to Laurenti. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm aware. I'm, I'm aware. I just thought it was funny. Uh, I, I, for one, have no intention to shed any blood today. Um, I hope to uh, merely ensure that everyone gets their fair share and that we can be on our way. Well, you should speak to her. She's right. up there. We won't get in your way. Um, I should tell you. Yes. And Terry uh, took Henson and uh, Henson and uh, Creed with her. All right. Uh, Henson apparently is going to play three musical notes on a strange horn composed of three distinct distinct segments of uh, like animal horns uh, there is a bird on the ship uh, a minor bird named uh, loudwing uh, that has been perfectly mimicking the three tones for the past several hours. If you wish to, uh, you could take Loudwing with you. It might help you open this place. Hmm. Yeah. Well, perhaps it would be... Hmm. Perhaps All it right. would be a bad look to... Uh, you, so you, so you said that. Uh, sorry, I wouldn't say this in person. Uh, so essentially, this bird could re- play the instruments without the could need of heartbreak. Well, yeah, because heartbreak's already in there. So yeah. they're locked. So they're essentially locked in whatever vault contains all their treasure, right? Yeah. Our options are break down the door or use the other key. All right. One, One of those is inherently aggressive. What is Yao Hua? It's a bird. No, but oh, what, what kind? It's a, it's a, it's a thrush. But yeah, no, I think, uh, I think we would, we would, uh, we would take that. And uh, before we go, Tone would, uh, Tone would kind of gesture for Hormheb to step, clo- uh, step closer. Sure. And uh, he'll say, uh, Quartermaster, I, when I met you, you told me about how in your past you did something that you did not regret, regret and that you looked forward. I hope that whatever happens after today, that you can still look back at, today, uh, at our journey together and remember the good times and look forward. That is a deeply ominous thing to say. Yeah, I mean... Yeah, like... <laughs> what the hell? You aren't going to do exactly what she thought you would do, right? If it doesn't, it, hopefully, it doesn't come to that. Oh. I mean... Oh, dear. Okay. Tone. Oh. Oh. You're scaring I mean, us, too. thought you were past this. I think... Tone would like visually. He would. He would like visually, kind of like, uh, take a like double back and look at you when you say say that. I, I'm, just, what, what do you mean? You think of it from their perspective. We show up. We obliterate everything we are put in front of. Uh, what's in their life? It's you know it's similar to mercenary life, but there's a sense of honor in in mercenary life. We we work, we get paid, we stick to the terms of our job. Uh, it's pretty clear here that that's not the same thing here, not in the pirate life. What's to say? What's to stop in the captain's mind and in the mind of a lot of the crew? I assume. What's to stop the the five, you know, deadly mercenaries they've, they've brought on board from killing them all and taking all their stuff. 
it hurts deeply that they think we're the kind of people that do that or that would do that. But I get it. <laughs> I'm the the captain and and heartbreak and I mean I haven't spoke to Vance much, but Vance and all the crew seem like mighty nice people, and I'm sure there's a a diplomatic way to settle this. I get it. As long as we get what we're owed, I'm not going to do anything. And hell, even if we don't get what we're owed, I mean. As long as we can get passage to the wedding. Yeah. Yes, yes, all right, the wedding. Yes, I... I... I don't... I don't know what came over me there. I... There's... I just... I feel like in these, these past few... This past day that I've... That something has, has frustrated me. We've done so much together since since reuniting and it felt like so much has changed but i don't know the betrayal at this at this turn even if it was expected in our line of work just made it feel like nothing's changed at all but welcome no to my life you'll get used to it it hurts <laughs> but then's the break someone's always looking to stab you in the back someone's always looking to double cross you That's Where's the, the way the world is? is? We're not going to stab you in the back. Yeah, no, Even no. if you don't go up there. I well, swear I I'll bring you your share. Even if it gets me killed. Let's just have a chat with the captain. And not worry about all this. You have my word that we won't do the same to you. I'm sorry. sorry. I don't mean to... I'd... I, what I meant, I, I didn't, I didn't know. I didn't, I wasn't thinking. That wasn't me. I hope you can see it in your heart to forgive me. I can. You are an honorable man. But honorable men can do horrible things. I've seen the Knights of Kaldor when they ride down into Gadira. They slaughter and they rape just like common soldiers. Because they don't see us as worthy of respect. Same thing can happen to any man. Yeah. Something that I need to I need to ponder on. Thank you. And we'll we'll see each other soon in good spirits. I hope so. I know. I so. Good. Uh, and he's going to be set off. Okay. So you grab the songbird and... Yeah, songbird. Uh, you guys are going to... Grab this mina. Uh, where are you heading first? Uh... temple that they're at, right? Okay. It, I mean, unless I'm forgetting something. I mean, uh, no, you could totally go there. Uh, there is also a uh, a uh, lighthouse uh, near the temple that you could head to. Uh, there's also just deeper into the forest. Obviously, you probably don't want to go to either of those places, so you are going to head up towards the temple. Uh, we can investigate the rest later. Give me like ten minutes. I need to pull something on this map. Okay, I gotcha. Uh, let's go. Uh, so, it was not ten minutes. It was much shorter than I thought it would be. <laughs> Um, so, oh, shit, it's not working. Well, 10 more minutes. No, it's not going to be 10 minutes. 10 cave minutes. 
seven more minutes. It exactly isn't working. Uh, Denon's laying. Ah, uh, I see. Yeah, that will be ten Gabe minutes. If we're so, if we're walking there, um, Tone will kind of pipe up from the back and say, "Should we even go? Would our presence even be seen as aggressive? Perhaps this is a bad idea. You know, I maybe we." If it gets to that, we'll sort it out. And if we don't, we'll knock them out, drag them back to the ship and say, look, we could have killed you. We didn't. Let's not Indeed. do that. <laughs> yeah. Also, Ormheb said we should come here and talk to the captain. I'm sure, you know, we'll, we'll work it out. I'm definitely going to ask for a raise because that was a dick move. Uh... But let's let's worry about getting our passage and getting our share before we ask for a raise. I'd just like to know that I'm going to be stabbed in the back ahead of time. Yeah, Even if yeah. it's more of a light tickle than a stab. Yeah. But uh We'll get there. When we get there we'll talk we'll, we'll play it by ear. Kind of. I mean, best case scenario, we come in and save them from some traps or something, and then uh, it's all forgiven. Yeah. yeah. It seems your quartermaster has made it known that there should be no surprise that we'll show up, so showing up to save the day or not, I believe that she may welcome us more than hate us. Okay. I got it. Should work. I'm gonna drag you guys out on the map. I'm gonna move you over. Move, move, move. I just move. dragged two time out twice. Ah. Instead of dragging out. Well, that's why two, they call them two time. One of the many reasons. <laughs> one of at least six reasons why they one call of, them two time. One of 14 or 15 reasons why they call them two time. Now he just needs to uh, find another potential uh, romantic attraction aside from Doc, and... Uh, oh god, you two time un Unfortunately for Tone, uh, throughout this entire journey, Yao Hua has been flirting with the Mina. Uh, <laughs> you, can't just, you can't just retcon that on that with me! You can only, you can only uh, understand half of the conversation. Uh, <laughs> because... Uh, Two time is uh You mean Yao Hua? I mean Yao Hua two time is a did I just say two time? Yes, <laughs> yes, yes, yes. I meant to say Yao Hua. I think because of the thing I mentioned. <laughs> two time and... uh So what what is the half that Tone can hear? No 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 Tone is going to uh uh put his hands over his ears even though it's a telepathic link and say this is the worst day it actually isn't you uh you hear the language you also have an empathic link oh, <laughs> oh no oh i didn't even think about that just pure <laughs> lust <laughs> If I have a if if I have an empathic link with my familiar and they're getting all of my emotions go all of their if I'm getting all their emotions can I send them my emotions? Sure. I will send a uh, a a uh, a spike of of uh, apathy and frustration his way. Pure edge. Yes. Uh. He says something really incelly. <laughs> How can you do this to me, Gabe? <laughs> what do you? That's that's what it would be if you got a hit of apathy and uh, annoyance uh, when you were <laughs> flirting with someone. <laughs> oh, it, I'm smiling so much it hurts. I'm saying this is this is a culmination. This is a, this is a culmination of, of many sessions of Gabe dictating my. Uh, my bird. This is not what I envisioned. Uh, I mean, what had you envisioned? He'll say, uh... Not this! <laughs> say, oh god, you need to figure this out. Um... 
he'll say, you probably want to stork like all you probably. Hey, you probably want to stork like all the other ladies. They're all tall and shit. You don't like a short guy like me. Can I like fade what, what do I gotta be over, over two feet tall? <laughs> I forgot the Brooklyn accent. His tone will mage hand his familiar. I, I don't grab it out of the air. <laughs> you literally not. Yeah, it's, I, it's, it, it has to be no, a, an object. There is, however, a there is a. A uh, magical trick, uh, feet, you can make magic trick for uh, mage hand, and you can make unarmed strikes with your mage hand. Oh, oh that's my god, sweet. that's awesome. Toad will train for three days to learn how to do this just to get his bird to shut up. Okay. <laughs> no. So, uh, a 20 foot tall stone monument rises from the brush in the small clearing. This mon monument bears rows of weathered inscriptions. Uh, and seems to have part of it collapsed next to it, though it still rises 20 feet. Uh, at the far end of the clearing, a large waterfall pours down from the cliffs above into a clear pool of water. Uh, you know what? Just a second. Oh my god, you can't. How tall is this broken pillar? Uh, it's uh, 20 feet tall, and then there's more bits of it like that have collapsed. Yeah. Can I scramble on up and just take a, take a peek around? Sure. <laughs> Okay. Uh, you are going to see. Uh, a large open space beyond the waterfall, which I forgot to cover up with dynamic lighting. <laughs> well, I can't see it anyway, so you don't see Yep. <laughs> uh, I will reveal it. There you go. Uh, oh, this bit. You're talking yeah. about this. That is what I'm talking about. Oh, okay. I was wondering what this was. Okay, gotcha. Uh, uh -huh. Good to know. I can... <laughs> Problem solved. Uh, um, you see there is writing and markings on what? this. What does it say? That you're standing on. Uh... What languages do you speak? These. Okay. Anyone else want to try and read this thing? Uh, I don't. Unless it's in Halfling, I don't have any different languages. We gotta have common, at least. Well, no, I mean, any like, different? my. Yeah, I have the same language as, as Tyler, except I don't have. Uh, or, I, I have it. Halfling. The guy report. Uh, well, uh, if you want to, you can make a linguistics check if you have ranks in it. Nope. Okay. <laughs> uh, in that case, uh, you're not sure what it says. Mm -hmm. Tom? Tom, Tom you like can't read of... this, can you? Tom feels like the kind of guy to have ranks in linguistics. Out. Oh, he said he had to dip out for a moment. Uh, ah, I'm, I'm here. Oh, yeah. he did. Cool. Uh, uh, do you have ranks in linguistics, or do I have ranks in linguistics? And what uh, language we can't read? I do have ranks in linguistics. Yes. So, uh, so where is the writing? On the pillar, Sleepy is standing on. Okay, um, posting languages. And now I will. If, if none of those are in those languages, I none of those are the right one. 
And a Lagrosis check can be made here. Yep. All right. 28. Mm. God damn. 28. Uh, you recognize this uh, to be an ancient language uh, <laughs> invented uh, by the Cyclops. This is Cyclops. Mm. Uh, technically, uh, it would be a uh, Golan. G H O L A N. Uh, named after their empire, the Golgon, uh, which uh, once ruled a large section of Galarian. Um. Uh, okay. Uh, oh, linguist checks can only identify languages. I couldn't really interpret a meaning from it, from that role. Uh, no. Alright. But comprehend languages, other spells would be able to. Yeah, I, I uh, unfortunately do not have those. Uh, Tone will say it appears uh, uh, Cyclopean in Origins, although I. I do not have, uh, um, I'm not lingual in this, uh, in this script. Well, it probably doesn't matter. Come on, let's go. I think you, yeah. <laughs> Heavy, I feel, I believe you should, you should have more of appreciation for these things. I mean, this is an ancient temple. Does, do you never, do you ever once wonder why they've been put here or how they became abandoned? No. Ugh. No, I'm with Heavy. I suppose I can't claim that I'm surprised. It's, I mean, it's a, it's a little interesting, but unless there's loot inside, I... Uh... So, is this uh, like a raised platform? Uh, yes. How far out? Uh, it is uh, five feet up. Okay. Uh, and the waterfall is pouring down in front of it. Ah, that's this is the probably issue. where we have to play the thing. Stop the waterfall? I don't know. I, we don't really know where we play the notes, right? Uh, yeah. We can. Yeah, we can try it. Let's try the. Okay. Um, sing, bird, sing. Uh, <laughs> your bird companion tone will say uh, hey baby sing for me <laughs> <laughs> and it will sing uh, three notes and uh, you hear is it the first three <laughs> notes of also Sprach Zarathustra no. Aww. Ah. Uh, the... Okay, the turn. Tyler, your background noise. What do you hear? I don't think that's Tyler. No, that's that was, that, was, that was my mom. I have to oh. be in the front room because they, they were painting something in the office. I see. I, I hear people yelling in the background and I assume it's Tyler. I, yeah, Fair I enough. just assume it's Ty, uh, Tommy. Uh, the water doesn't change. Okay. Well, there's more to the outside of this temple, right? Like, this isn't the only way to approach, right? It looks like there's walls all the way around. Yeah, it's it's like part of a mountain. Well, oh, it's like built only one way to try this. Uh, and they... How high up is it? It's five feet. Yeah, I'm just going to zoom myself up there. Okay. All uh, right. You blast the water, and on the other side... And from the inside, you can see uh, that there is a thin set of steps leading up. 
that could be walked on uh, coming from this direction, heavy. And I will also describe uh, a cracked land laid of a, cl a cracked landing of laid stone spreads before a pair of great stone doors. Vines and other plants grow over much of the waterfall soaked granite that forms the walls and ceilings of this hidden entrance. The doors, set about ten feet into the cliff face, are covered with runes and depictions of powerful one-eyed warriors and robed spellcasters fighting serpent folk. Each side of the landing bears an alcove with a ten-foot-tall chiseled humanoid statue uh, with a single great eye standing vigil. Piles of weeds and vines lie at the base of the doors and both statues, apparently recently cut or pulled from the rock. The stone, the floor of this stone landing is covered in mud and rocks, and no, there are no visible windows or other entrances other than the main doors. All right. Well, um, I'm going to let people know about the stairs over on this side. Okay. Uh, you shout it out. Yep. You can easily move across. Uh, you guys watch as Sleepy climbs up. Easy peasy. Squeezy lap. Yeah. Uh, the mina will follow you guys through. Let's see. Uh, the, you notice on the floor is a worn stone circle, um, that seems to have runes that have been worn away through time so that they're a little bit more indistinct. Um, hmm. go ahead and give me a perception check. Yes. Right? Perceive. If the runes could have been Arcana. Uh, yeah, you could roll an Arcana check on them as well, but you could also make a perception check. I think the perception check is to see where the runes are, the Arcana is to know what they mean. Nope, they're separate checks. Oh, okay. Uh, let's see. Uh, both Tone and Sleepy will recognize that this was some sort of magical trap. Uh, you can't determine what kind, uh, but it has been worn away and no longer functions. Uh, I need the same thing, obviously. Uh, the perception check notices footprints in the layer of m muddy, powdered stone. Obviously, Tone does not get this. Everyone else does. Uh... Powdered stone uh, that covers the landing. Uh, the footprints are fresh and lead through the door, showing that the door have recently opened and closed. Let's try the song again. I imagine. Hey, sing again. <laughs> you sing me up. Ah, uh, the. Door will respond with a equal uh, precision uh, and uh, sing the notes back to you. And then the doors will swing open. Hey. Uh, 
Oh. They hope everyone is ready. Should we announce ourselves to the captain? I think we've already done that well enough. Yeah. If we <laughs> sense them, if we sense them, then we will. Works for me. Okay. Uh, the door swings wide open. Uh, the entry hall stands open. Uh, it's carved stone ceiling is 20 feet high. A cyclopean marble statue stands on the left on the right side of the wall and a pile of rubble lies opposite to it. I guess they're saying left from the perspective of left. you as players? Yeah. yeah. That doesn't make any fucking sense yeah, why no. I would do that. Uh... On the, on the right side. side of the hall, uh, and a pile of rubble stands opposite it. Uh, just past the statue, shadows envelop the hallway in absolute dark. Well, guess who's got dark vision? <laughs> uh, yeah. The half elf, who is also a void kineticist. Go hit the traps. Oh, wait, no, we're following the captain. The captain hit the traps. Well, yeah. yeah. Do we still see... Can we follow that set of per, uh, footprints that we saw? Like, do uh, the footprints continue, or do they, they die lead, after They plane? lead out about to here, and then they die out. Well, nice here or where? Uh, the walls depict rich, religious rituals performed by giants with a single eye in the center of their foreheads in battles between giant folk and serpent-like humanoids. Alright, Heavy's not looking at any of that. I mean, I can Wait, why can't that. That's a pretty... Can I do a knowledge history? Uh, sure. Uh, i be a knowledge history. Yeah. 17. Uh... You get the feeling that this is pre-Earthfall, and therefore it's too long ago for you to have much knowledge of. Oh. <laughs> uh, I have low light vision. Is this still... Is my vision accurate? I don't know. Yeah, your vision should be accurate. Because I still only see, like... Yeah, it's not changing there for me, and I got low light as well. It's, it's yeah, well, well that's... Um, yeah, I'm assuming we gotta yeah. light something. Yeah, well, you can I, use, uh, I don't. Can I, cast, can I cast dancing lights. Sure. Uh, I will give you light. Thank you. Ooh, just because I think it'll be fun, uh, I will also kneel down to the ground and touch my ghost vision close to my forehead and oh, see what? if I can see any undead. Uh, can you control that? Uh, do I have the lantern? Yes, I can. Fantastic. Oh, funny. Come back. Right. Be careful. Uh, be careful for any. Uh, heavy, uh, you are gonna see something. Heavy, you see a stone monolith lies shattered. Uh, in this diamond shaped alcove reduced to large chunks of rubble uh, the larger fragments resemble the pylon standing outside the waterfall though they bear different inscriptions the withered body of a giant lies face down amid the wreckage I think these statues might be some sort of coffins Fascinating. That would mean that every single one we've seen so far is some member of this old Cyclopean Empire? Some Probably. Giant hero. And the tracks have died out, so we don't know which way to turn, right? Indeed. Don Sleepy, do you know any magic to find people? Um. Hmm. Uh... Uh, not anyone in particular, no. No. Actually, uh, you know, 
can I also be, uh, I like to be invisible. I feel like I'm going to be cast the ward on last note, be invisible for five rounds. Okay. A little, being a little sneaky. Do I? Just in case. I'm going to activate my ghost vision gloves near a statue. Uh, you do not detect any undead uh, right here. How long does that extend out? Uh, that's a good question. Let me ping the ghost vision gloves. One second. Most could be using that. Ghost vision gloves. Uh, it sounds like it's just my vision. Or no, within 60 feet, clearly. Including ethereal undead and incorporeal undead hiding in objects or walls to a depth of 5 feet. So yeah, 60 you feet. You don't detect any uh, undead. Okay, okay, I will use uh, one round of it, and then I will turn it off, and I will relay this information to the party. So I suppose that's one less thing to worry about. I mean, that doesn't... They could still be like those... Uh, like the crazy skeleton looking things at the, the Temple of Gozra. Yeah, I can also... They could be constructs or something, but they're not undead. I'll also be having Death Watch up. So okay. I'll, I'll also be able to see undead for help people's health. Okay. Um, I'm going to perceive the broken monolith and the withered giant for clues. Yeah, does the, sure. so yeah. I assume because it's described as withered, it's been dead for a while, like a long time. Oh, uh, yeah. Last Snow gets the feeling that this thing has been dead for a while. It was dead for a while, and then it was killed also a while ago. So once it, you think this thing was undead before it died again. Did it dead die again like a while ago within the last day, like the pirate crew? No, you think this was a, a long time ago. Hmm. Gabe, I have a question. Yeah. Oh, maybe 20 years is what you think. So, Death Watch says you can determine the condition of creatures near Death Watch or near death within the spell's range. And since it's just a 30 foot cone, do I need to be able to see them to know? Or if there's a creature within the rage, say, hiding and or invisible like right. myself. Uh, it determines the condition. It doesn't determine the location. So you have to be able to see a creature in order to determine their condition. Got it. Okay, perfect. Thank you. I thought I just had some, for, some version of radar. It's like, there's another Bing. life force thing here. You don't actually technically need to be able to see them as well to get their condition. You just need to be able to be aware of them which way are we going left or right this way suppose. suppose we could go to the left this way is any. i have the best vision here i'll take point yes be careful for any more of those 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 runic platforms. i see someone yeah uh -huh. Uh, within this expansive room, Cyclopean statues stand at attention, pointed toward the center of the room, uh, from alcoves set in the facing walls. At the northeastern, uh, end of the room, uh, stairs lead ten feet up to a stone table. You see Hinson is slumped beside the stone table within this room. Slump. Yep. Oh dear. Is he injured? Um, well, I, I'm... I'll say to the rest of the party, Hinson's up ahead. He looks either unconscious or down. I'll go check on him. Careful. You make a lot of noise when you move. Yep. I, I'm not even trying to be quiet. I'm just moving right up to him. And I would like to try and make a heal check to try and figure out what sort of condition he's in. Uh, sure. Uh, he looks okay. You're looking at him. His eyes are open. He's injured on his body. 
but he's just staring straight ahead. Is he breathing? Yep. Instant. Hello, you there? What? Sorry. What? Uh, oh, it's you folks. Shit, uh, looks like we made minute. the right call. Uh. Something appears. What sort of something? Oh, uh, sleepy, don't move. Move back to where you were. Everyone else hold their place. <laughs> oh, spooky! Oh, oh shit! <laughs> Uncle Daco. So it's something around that corner then, because I can't see what you're freaking out about. <laughs> I was like, "What?" I, was, I just wanted like I'm waiting for the torch to move past. Like, what? I just want to see what's in there. <laughs> no, it's here. I can't. How do I make it so that the image? Expands hours. I don't remember it anymore. Uh, shift Z, Shift Z, Control Z, Control Shift Z. One of them. I thought it was Shift Z. It was. Right click and show to players, maybe. Sure. Nope, that is not an option. Huh? Maybe that's why Shift Z isn't working. Oh, there it is. Works. Okay, cool. Hmm. Uh, you see a uh creature. Uh, you see in front of you uh a single milky eye stares from the forehead of a towering giant, wrapped in filthy rune-covered strips of bloody linen. Uh, this creature uh apparently moves with incredible stealth uh, for its size because it has made its way directly behind your back. Uh, and I am going to need uh, some initiative. Uh, it bumps its foot into you. That's what triggers initiative. Because you were oh. also stealthed. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's very funny. Double stealth do 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 double stealth do 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 Oh yeah, I still had like a plus twenty, I was forgetting about. Okay. That's my bad. Uh, and I need a perception check from each of you to see if you uh are acting in the surprise round. Yep. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Not tone. A uh, sleepy will auto pass. Sick, because I just got <laughs> I got jumped on a <laughs> Yeah, I imagine. I imagine this perception check is less like it's it's more about reacting to Sleepy's scream than anything else. Okay, uh, we got a thirty-nine. Is the only one that passes. Oh my! Oh! God. That is insane. That's terrifying. I don't feel bad for failing now, because it would <laughs> yeah. not even be possible. It's two times Sleepy and the Goldaco that are acting. Uh, I'm going to add Hinson's turn. Give me a second. Man, I'm just kind of spot on. Well, being someone basically on, invisible. On the bright side, I have I have remembered that I have resistance to sneak attacks. So okay, I think we are ready to go. It is Tone's turn first. You are surprised. Yes, I am. Heartbreak is also surprised. He doesn't know he's been found by that creature. Uh, two time. It is your turn. I don't. You much. hear. You hear footsteps behind Sleepy before he gets bumped into. I don't much care to move that close to this thing. Sensible. Yeah. Can I... I don't have... It doesn't have cover to me, right? I can draw... 
I think I think you have to move here because there's this wall. I think, or maybe it's no. You can. Oh, no. It's can one corner on you to no. all corners on. You. It would still no. It has no cover yet. Okay, then I'm just gonna. I don't get point blank shot because it is uh, not within thirty of me. Wait, wasn't uh, that last one within thirty? Thirty-five. No, I was measuring from here. If I got you. I could five foot step, but then it is also within thirty feet of me. It also uh, probably has reach, but that's, I, that's, that's I don't it. much feel like being close to it, so I'm just gonna take a pot shot at it. Go ahead. Yeah, uh, little, little standard action. So yep, yep. Pop your shot. Uh. Now it's time for me to make sure I know how my character works. Uh. I don't need. Deadly aim, I can do at any range, right? Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna deadly aim, because. Uh, boop. 25. Uh, 25 meets its AC. Yeah, because it's not uh -huh. touched, because I'm not within range. And, uh, your pistol's range is 20 feet. Oh, it's first range is 20 feet. Uh, so you would have a minus 2? Uh, I believe so. So I don't think it would hit, actually. Yes, so the bullet will fly. Instantly accelerating out of this gun, and it slows down enough that it just bounces off of this thing's skin. On. Uh, and it is sleepy. Uh, turning around, looking at it, is it undead? Yes. I just want to make sure. It's not. You could roll like you get a knowledge check to know more. Like, uh, roll a knowledge check if possible. That's a good question, actually. What un is undead religion? Yes. Or. I'm moving into another room because my parents are very loud. Yeah. <laughs> Okay. You tell me what you were talking about. Uh, I I would like to just take a brief turnaround because I can tell if it's undead or a construct. Knowledge, knowledge. Uh, which where the uh, yes, I have ranks. Okay. Uh, you are going to. Recognize this creature uh, as something you do not know. <laughs> Sick. Uh, Good luck, brother. Thank you, Tommy. Uh, let's see. Milky Eye either means it has blind sight and can see me. Or it's blind. Or it's blind. Uh, full withdrawal. That's a first space is the first square is unattackable. Yes. So there's no real great way for me to. But. It, it's not if it can see me or not. I will just full look draw. I don't want to be next to this thing. <laughs> okay. And actually, since it bumped into me, it probably can't see me. So, 5, 10, 15, 30. Makes no attack of opportunity. Good to know. That's your turn. Uh, now it is. Also, I'm gonna assume I have like 
two rounds of stealth left as a random number between one and five. Understood. And yeah, that'll be my turn. Okay. This creature is going to move. And uh, let's see. Does it want to do anything else? Let me see if it can do anything. And it's just going to move. Uh, but it'll charge, you know. It can, I think. Yeah. Charge like that. Uh, and it takes a swipe at two time. Okay. That is a 31 to hit. Yeah. Uh, you take like 13 points of slashing and bludgeoning. And I need you to make a fort save. Uh, You've not had good history with these. I've not, but my fort is good. Eh? That's not bad. Okay. Okay. I'm not affected by anything? Uh -huh. Well, if you are, it's got an onset. Here we go. I'm gonna mark your token with that. Yep. Uh, what is that? I don't know, maybe if we had identified this thing, we'd know. Indeed. Well, I don't uh, acknowledge religion. Blame Tyler for the What did I miss? Uh, no. two time got got. Damn. Yeah, he got slashed. Uh, now it is... Back to the start of the round, it is Tone's turn. Alright, uh, Toad will also like to roll religion on this thing. Uh, here goes. 30. Uh, this thing is a Goldaco. Uh, it is a dreadful undead cyclops created by the foul priests and necromancers of a fallen cyclops empire thousands of years years ago. Uh, they are guardians of special relics or tombs, uh, having been ordered to protect the op object or location in life and remaining faithful to their duties after dying. Um, do they have any resistances? Oh, I'm not eating. I'm not it's drinking. It's I'm not drinking. I, I'm not it's drinking it, Mom. Just a taste. Just a taste. I'm not going to drink your just mushroom tea. Taste. I'm not drinking it. It's drink the mushroom tea! tea. <laughs> Get your psychedelic on. I have to see. This has got to be the most interesting uh, description of a, a Pathfinder character. Uh, do, <laughs> do not GM <laughs> under the influence of psil psilocybin. <laughs> Why not? Yeah, it, it doesn't. It okay, tastes, you're really it tastes to like cinnamon. This. It's like really fucking cinnamony. I. It's fine. Hey, long life. Long I life. don't want a long life. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> so real for that one, honestly. Um, Hang on, that's going in best of. I don't, that, wow. I learned a lot about the Goldaco today. God damn it. Uh, <laughs> Mom, I think you... It's great that you made that. I don't want it. I really don't like... Come on, this is a cell... <laughs> I really wanted to hear the rest of that. This is good shit. I could. I it's gonna to... make you live forever. I don't. Stop. Okay. <laughs> you don't want to live forever? You're really turning down the elixir of youth? Yeah, really? Okay. Uh, it's a Goldaku. Okay, let me tell you a few things that are useful. Uh, they make great mushroom tea. Don't drink the mushroom tea. Don't drink the mushroom tea. Uh, the disease that uh, Two Time just contracted uh, is called Seaside Rot. Uh, it has an onset of one minute, uh, a frequency of one per day. It does 1d4 strength and 1d4 dex damage. Oh, oh that's fine. It requires, it requires two saves to pass. That's fine. You're not going to die from it. Uh, 
I you don't die from getting reduced to zero strength, do you? Only if it's a shadow or rainbow scarab or powder that does drain, it. If it's drain damage as well. If it's drain not damage, it'll okay. kill you. Uh -huh. It'll just be annoying. But this is just damage. Uh could potentially put you in a coma for a very long time though. Uh let's oh, see. Okay. <laughs> it, 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 it also I have a has character. It also has an ability called Blinding Breath uh, that allows it to blind people in a 20-foot cone. Oh, fuck. Permanent. <clears throat> oh, permanent. fuck. If they fail a save. This one does seem to be injured. Perhaps by a recent fight. Uh, and then finally, it is resistant to cold and fire. Also, I assume also, it's immune to mind effect. Also, it is, yeah, I mean, it's a, uh, you guys can look up undead traits as a neutral evil large undead. Okay. Undead. Uh, alright. I think, uh, what Tone will do this turn is, uh, five foot oh, step back. Roll initiative for Yahua. Okay. Uh, yep. Yeah. All right, uh, I'm going to going to five foot step back, uh, move action, produce a tangle foot back, and chuck it up the sky. Gotcha. Uh, so I make, attack. make a ranged attack for a twenty six. That's a crit. Yep, uh, he is entangled. Uh, yes. It's like a reflex save, I think. A reflex save or be glued to the floor in addition. Yeah, but he's entangled no matter what. Uh, let's see. Is there an amount of duration that that's active for? Uh, I think uh, it's wait, like uh, a D4 round something. Uh, 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 one. Creature that is glued to the floor can break free, making a DC 17 strength check or by dealing 15 points of damage to the glue. Uh, yeah. It looks like it, the goo becomes brittle and fragile after two four rounds. That is the bag. It becomes brittle when? Sorry, you. 2d4 is the duration, okay. unless you destroys roll, it. Roll that, roll that up. Okay. So that's four rounds. Gotcha. Uh, is that your turn? Uh, Tone will say, Don't group up! It has a breath attack! Uh, and that will be the end of his turn. Does your entangle bag, is it only affecting him or reflecting the floor around him? I believe it only affects the target. So, okay. they're, so they're entangled, so this guy was pretty bad. Uh -huh. So he's, uh, so he's much, now he's been slowed down. He's easier to he does not seem to be tied down, but he will be entangled, so he'll have half a move speed. Yep. Uh, that is your turn. That's my turn. Uh, heartbreak is going to say, fuck, fuck, kill it, kill it, kill it. Uh, and that's his uh, bardic performance. <laughs> Plus what? Is that inspire, gonna... inspire uh, competence? No, it's Empire, it's Empire Courage. Uh, it gives you a no. plus two uh, competence bonus to your attack uh, rolls and your weapon damage rolls. So only damage rolls with weapons. Uh, and then it also gives a bonus on saves against charm and fear effects, but those won't affect the combat. So. My Does gun that is plus a weapon, right? Like, that's not add... a stupid question. Uh, what? My gun, gun is counts. a weapon. Yes, a gun okay. is a weapon. <laughs> Thank fucking god. If this system went like, nope, a gun isn't a weapon. Well, okay, so to, it was it was the ranged soul. weapon. I know Pathfinder can be confusing and stupid sometimes. Yeah. No, uh, not, not in this case. Also, I think your monk on arm strikes count as weapons. Yes, they do. Well, I was gonna say... Was that an attack bonus, or like it has to be a weapon attack? It's just flat attack. It also hits spells. 
yeah, but not it, CMB. It applies, it applies all to all attacks, also CMB. It would apply to CMB. Okay, that's oh, what I was then. wondering. So here's my that, plus two. CMB. Is... CMB, sorry. CMB. Yeah, CMB. Okay. Yeah. I, I miss said CMB. I thought I heard B anyway, so... <laughs> Good. Uh, and that's all Heartbreak's gonna do. He, uh, he'll actually reposition himself so that he's hiding more behind this back here. So that'll be his turn. Uh, two time. I'm gonna five foot step here. Uh, it doesn't have cover from me. I'm within 20 feet of it. So my shit is hitting at touch. Uh, yep. I'm rapid shotting, point blank shotting, so I will get one, two, three. Well, I'll get one before I crit fail, because of course I do. Uh, uh 19 will hit its clutch. Uh, and then as a swift act, I can do a swift action on the same turn I do a full round action, right? Uh, it seems to resist some of the damage that you dealt it. Uh, yeah, you can. Uh, I'm going to... Can I can't do it in the middle of my attack, right? I wanna... Um, I, wanna I wanna quick this. I can do it with a swift uh, if I spend a grip point. So I'm you actually can? Swift. Because because you... Oh no, because you nat one on the attack number two. Um... No, you cannot do that. No, well, I can you, do it at the end. Started the full round. Right? I can do it at the uh, end. You can do it at the what? I wanted to just know if I could get that third attack off. If I did it, it's fine. Well, I it's can... a move it. Oh, I thought it was swift. I'm stupid. No. Never mind. Oh, that's why I was like, you can't do it. I thought. I it thought was... like, oh, it was... you shot. It was the first one, but they didn't. You didn't crit fail on the first one. That's what I was thinking. Uh, oh, and that okay. would be seventeen it's... points of damage and a twenty-one to hit. Oh, cool. I don't have bardic. Case. I don't have bardic shit on here. Well, you could just up a pipe. Yeah, you're yeah right. here. I'll just freaking ping you my freaking. Yeah, you can make your custom. You make a custom mod. Put this in that. Oh, hey, Enzy's got, got a better, better one. one. Uh, next up, it is sleep. <laughs> Put on blast. Put on blast for his custom inspired uh, courage. <laughs> I will a twenty foot cone. I don't want to feel real safe right here. Uh. Because what? It. Five foot step. It still can't see me. Who really doesn't want to be blinded? Me. Everyone. <laughs> Fair. <laughs> uh, how? Oh, that's a touch spell, right? And a creature touch, yes. Um. Yeah. Or actually, no, I have it. You know, if I want, if you guys want, I could heal it. Um, I don't think it's very helpful. For, question, for life pact. Do I need a C? I have his blood. Um, do you need to see who? Heavy. No. Okay. Then everyone knows life pact. Uh, Alright, um, what's, what's that do again? Basically, if you go to... If you reduce to fewer than zero, everyone who is afflicted by life pact loses one HP on the person who's who's down's turn. So right. with with everyone game. 
that'd be one, two, three, four, five, six, Yahua included. You would why gain six we, HP. Why did we do that when I went down last game? Because <laughs> I didn't have it. I didn't cast it. I oh, you have to cast it. Yeah. Oh, okay, I see. Yeah, so yeah. I cast it now. It's going to last for six minutes. There we go. Pink bubbles, everyone. Yeah. Throw down a pink bubble on your tokens. Yeah, and also Show your has a tone, so don't forget that because okay. he's he's a, he's an HP resource now. Did you <laughs> saw my bird as a blood bag. Yes. <laughs> That's all he's good for. Thank you. I think, <laughs> I think you. I think you'll find he's a bird bag. A bird. Oh, bag. so true. What are you doing? Uh, I'm going to move from 5, 10, 15, 20. Also, since you cast a spell, doesn't that mean you've lost invisibility? No. Nope. Only hostile actions. Hmm. Correct. Or remove invisibility. So, if you're a summoner, this is just for anyone who's ever playing a summoner. Go invisible. Invisible <laughs> Invisibility on you, and then just summon things. And they'll attack, and you don't have to, and you'll win. <laughs> also, that's me at half speed to remain stealthy. So I'm gonna gotcha. to, to re-enter stealth. So if I move, that's plus twenty for stealth. Uh, yes, with the uh, the um, invisibility. Yeah. Yes. Cool. Okay, you are very hidden. Heavy. All right. First things first. Move action to get to here. All right. Cool. And now, bladed or no? Um, blade blade rush. Yes, blade rush. So no. Oh, what it's called it's not what's called uh you whoops that's still hunting horn <laughs> and that's what, that's what henson's using right now yeah and i'm going to not use any other infusions just this for now because i'm trying to be safe about burn and i'm gonna fucking hit a bitch or try anyway 24 I will not hit. Mm. Bitch. Even uh, with the, you, even with the oh wait, I forgot the plus two from I forgot the plus two from the blade rush. Is is that including the minus four to dexterity that would affect its AC? It is not including it. So it would hit. So it would hit. Yeah. I also include the other thing. So that's twenty six bludgeoning damage. Yep. It resists some of that. Okay, that's fine. Did my knowledge check not get any resistances of it? No, it's just, does it oh, require you any elemental resistances? Because I figure that would be what Tone would look for. Yep. And it didn't. And it didn't have any other than cold because it's firing a, cold. Cold fire and fire. cold. Okay, sorry. I was just. I, Undead I don't have cold resistance naturally. Oh really? Okay. <laughs> nope. I thought they had immunity for a really long time. <laughs> All of them. But yeah, I, I was going to say. I could have sworn I heard you say something along those lines like a few weeks ago. <laughs> No, no, it was like fucking goddamn years ago. I think a year and a half ago, actually. Mm -hmm. uh, let's see. Doesn't it provoke attacks of opportunity from moving? So activating it does, but obviously it was not threatening you when you activated it. It yep. is last snow's turn. Um, so my knowledge of grappling larger creatures is that there's no real downfall. Well, not downfalls, um, debuffs if they're only one size larger. That is very true. Uh, there is no debuffs at all. It doesn't matter if they're one size larger or a little bit. You might want to roll acrobatics to avoid its attack of opportunity, though. If you're gonna move yep, like I was I was going to move there. I knew I was going to do that. 25. That will fail. What? It's going to claw into you. Uh, it will natural one, though. So that's not going to hit. Wonderful. Nice. Perfect. Good. Finally, I get one of those. 
And then I will move to grapple him further. Okay. Oh! An equal exchange. I the laws of God right. damn it. God. <laughs> the laws of alchemy. <laughs> I have a fucking plus 20 and I rolled a 1. Yeah, oh! you, uh, you will uh, fail to grapple this thing. Like, you grab its wrist and then it just sort of like lifts you part way off the ground before you release it. <laughs> Uh, it is Yao Hua. Uh, Yao Hua will decide if it's worth to. If I have enough spell slots left. I don't think I do. I'm gonna check. Um, yeah, I don't think they will be doing much this round. By much, I mean nothing. Cool. Uh-oh. They'll delay their movement to move with me. I'll be up. Uh, let's see. It would like to enter the maybe if it was possible. Let's Apropos see. of nothing, Sleepy, do you have <laughs> removed blindness? Uh, you know, it's really awkward that Gabe was like, man, you're never gonna cast remove blindness? And I'm like, yeah, probably not. And he's like, man, crazy. <laughs> Super crazy about that. <laughs> I didn't say it. You said yeah. That. Yeah, you said you'd never cure a blind man. <laughs> Good thing I'm a blind yeah. halfling. It's, it was a direct <laughs> quote, my man. No, I know. It was just uh, it's awkward. <laughs> all I'm saying. Now, does this his breath count as a disease for the blindness? Uh, let me well, see. he hasn't done it yet. But <laughs> well, I'm just for my character. I want to know. Let's see. His blindness is not a disease. Mm. Uh, he does have a disease on his claws, but yeah. uh, that is separate. You know what? I don't think he wants to do the blindness yet, because Heavy is scary, and he wants to kill him. So Good. It, would be, it would be easier to kill him if he was blind. But it would be faster to kill him if he didn't blind. If he didn't blind. You know what I mean? Watch as he blinds everyone but me because fort There's... save. My There's fort save two... like plus nine. There's two people he needs to blind. He needs to blind heavy and two time. Does he... How is less important? Does he need to blind me? So true. Tone is less important. Can he? Oh right, he wasn't rooted. He's just yeah. He can't. He can't catch. Uh, two. Oh no, he can't five foot step. Good point. Uh, he can't catch two time if he tries to catch two tone. So he's gonna hit two time and heavy. Okay. So I need a uh, fourth save from both of you. Twenty six. Oh, that's pretty good. <laughs> That is very good. You guys, well, two time passes exactly. Oh. <laughs> so he releases this breath out, uh, and then he is going to uh, screech out this like roar, uh, and he is going to five foot step backwards. I thought he could. No, he can't, because he's still entangled. He's, half moving. he's gonna... Five foot step in a square dance. He's gonna die. <laughs> he's gonna do a funny little jig in place. Uh, yeah, it's gonna be his turn. Uh, so he releases his breath and he can't do anything else. Uh, and it is Tone's turn. Uh, alright. Uh, Tone is going to. Uh, is going to roll his hands together uh, and conjure up a flaming sphere 
Now this thing is immune to uh, resistant to fire, of which I know from the, the the check. So I'm going to versatile evocation and transform it into acid damage. Uh, and I and I will uh, pick a point, throw it there, and as long as uh, as long as a uh, creature is within the square, I believe it takes damage on a, uh, unless it fails a unless it succeeds a reflex. Uh, so I will I will place into that square. I can create a little thing if you like. Yep, go ahead. A green orb. The green orb we shall all ponder on together. Uh, so that is that is the effect, uh, and then he makes the reflex save. And now I believe, yep, uh, he will get a nineteen. Uh, a nineteen, I believe, passes. Yes, and that's uh, is that with the minus four to uh, dexterity? Yes, it is. Ah, oh, I was hoping it was. You got a twenty-one. But oh, I see. Uh, let me oh, check to make sure. It's co mixture that bumps the DC. Yeah. Yep. I unfortunately and yeah, I can't. I can't combine those here. Uh, okay. Yep. So that's okay. And then uh, I, 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 in that case, I will spend my move action to move away. I thought it. Uh, oh, it doesn't take anything on a fail. Yeah, unfortunately. Yep. Uh, but the the thing about this is that it's persistent. Oh, gotcha. Okay. Uh, Heartbreak continues his shouting for you to kill it. Uh, he sounds terrified. Kill, kill, kill. I can't see it. Two times. Uh, now, now you have I can uh, take some action. Cover. I can, I'm going to take okay. a move action to or a move equivalent action to clear the misfire on my gun uh, so it is functioning normally again and I'll spend a point of grit to do that. Uh, and then I will. So I can five foot step and take a move equivalent action, right? Yeah, you absolutely can. Uh, I will five foot step here. Am I within. I'm within 20. Uh, so all my stuff applies. I'm not rapid shotting because it's not a four round action. Spare courage, oh. deadly aim, point blank shot. Heavy will provide it with soft cover. I so it's gonna get a plus four to its touch AC. But I mean, it's a big thing. You'll probably hit it. You do hit it. Uh, that it is going to be reduced a little bit, uh, but you deal some damage to it. Beautiful. Oops. Put down the shots. There we go. Uh, it is Sleepy's turn. Uh, is it going to try and blind again? Is my question. Uh, can I quickly ask Tone? Hey, Tone, can it blind multiple times? Or is it like a recharge? Would I know that from the skill check? Uh,. I, uh, it needs to wait a time, but I can't. I don't know without more information. You could do it at any period between now and a few seconds. Uh, so at minimum it's around, so I can't do it this turn. Yeah. Yes. Who also side question that is uh, who has a ring of protection? Not me. And oh, or heavy. Do you have a ring of protection? Uh, yes, I do. Okay, because I'm thinking about casting Ward on somebody else than Last Snow. But also, Last Snow probably also. Because I think it wants to kill you more heavy. If it, isn't it undead? Don't you, don't your heals do positive damage? Well, yeah. positive damage to. You can heal undead? it to death. I have to touch it. I suppose that's true, yeah. I don't want to get close to that fucking thing. I'm very scared of it. It kicked me in the back, and I didn't notice it while I was invisible. So I'd rather not. I don't want to get close. <laughs> it's me. Uh, so I am going to cast Ward on 
the heavy because that's why. Because I think okay. he's that's why. And then, and then there's a ward on you. And then my thing is. Because... Oh, no, no. Uh, let us know can you post the ward buff. Mm -hmm. do, do, do. The eye, if you uh, click on the settings part of the buff. There we go. Uh, heavy. It is your turn. Right. Move action. Gather power. Then standard action. To Ravidic Whip twenty nine. That will hit. All right, cool. That's twenty eight damage. You take significantly less than you'd expect. Shit. That is still fine. <laughs> it is last snow's turn. I will attempt to do the same thing. That's oh, 27 uh, this time. Would you be flanking uh, if you were there? Uh, no. You can't flank. You can't flank yeah, large creatures? It's grapple. Uh, no, I mean, he can't oh. flank as in he oh, isn't right. flanking. Yeah, I'm saying that like, he, future turns, yeah. he could like five step over them. Sure. Yeah. I mean, you'd have to five and seven in this way, but yeah. Uh, let's see. This creature is going to be uh, ungrappled. 27 does not meet its CMD. Uh, and is it is going to... Is that plus two from an uh, Inspire Courage? That, yeah, it's already in there. Okay. Yeah. It's uh, not too it is going to be Yalpa's turn. Okay, um, I got no spells. Uh, I I think Yoha is gonna, we're just gonna pass the turn. I'll let you know if I intend to use it. Okay. Uh, Koldako is going to full round power attack heavy. Cool. Uh, okay, uh, lowest roll. 25 on the attack. Misses. Okay. The other one's definitely hit. Uh, you are going to take... Uh, let's... We're going to pop... My power down that way. Oh, shit. Uh, does a 28 confirm? Uh, well... Let's it, it would, but let's roll that D one hundred with a uh now twenty-five percent failure chance. Oh nice. So you wanna get below twenty-five. Roll for it. Fuck. Oh. Uh you are going to take Twenty-two plus uh, three, six, twenty-four plus. Uh, you are going to take sixty-seven points of damage from the crit. Oh my god! All right. Well, I'm unconscious. You are going to take. 22 points of damage from the non-crit. I'm bleeding out. Very good attack will miss. Uh, you get stabilized. Or no, you don't uh, get stabilized. But we all lose one hit point and Heavy goes... On, on, well, on his, his turn. turn. Oh, on his turn, yeah. okay. Yeah. Uh -huh. So I also have to make two fort saves, right? You are going to have to make one fort save. Only this one? Like the, uh... 25. And we're going to pass, so you won't be affected by that. Oh, wait, no. When he drops to zero, it automatically triggers. Okay, gotcha. So, okay. everyone take one damage except Heavy. Uh, is it, a, is it one damage? Heavy, you wouldn't take yes, one just damage. one. One damage from everyone, but that's six HP to Heavy. Uh, no. Yahua and Sleepy would not. Oh, I might be too point. far away. Yeah. 
Yeah, so I I heal for three, which puts me at one. Yep. But I am I am unconscious still because He's of my burn. Oh, okay. Ah, uh, that's what I was thinking of. Okay, got it. Uh, that is the Goldaku's turn. It is going to be Cones. Okay. Uh, it it remains first? entangled. Yeah, but he's still, he's still, okay, so at the beginning of my turn, he's got to make a reflex save, uh, lest he be hit by the acid ball. <laughs> yep. Okay, he makes the save. Well, uh, no, I don't know yet. Give me a second. Oh. Uh, he is not going to pass. Okay. Uh, so this, this, uh, this globule of acid begins to eat away at its, uh, King robes. Roll so I roll, I roll the damage. For 15. 15. He does not resist that. Uh, and as, uh, and with, uh, since I do not have precise shot, it's a minus four on attack rolls, correct? Because he's still engaged in combat with Lasto. Uh, yes. Okay. Uh, uh and. and you also, I don't think. Let me double check. I mean, no. does heavy does heavy provide cover while he's on the ground? No, he's not gonna have soft cover. Don't worry. That's what I was double checking. Yeah, so just the regular regular minus four. Okay. Uh, question: Did two times at second attack hit last? The first attack hit last round. The 18 against touch? Yep. Yeah. Okay, 18 against touch hits. Uh, alright then. Well, I'm gonna- I'm gonna give it a shot. I'm gonna conjure up a, uh, a, I'm gonna conjure up a snowball. And I'm going to evoke one more time. Turn it into, uh, into acid damage. Uh, here comes the attack roll. Nice. It is a 27 minus 4. Or, yes, plus 4, I mean. So you hurl this ball of acid at this creature, and it will strike uh, and deal some damage. All right. Uh, so I I I, uh, I I create this uh, uh, the the projectile, and I'll I'll after it impacts and and uh, splashes all over him, I'll take my other arm out and pull towards me, and you'll see like the uh, the liquid. Uh, kind of pull off in all of these directions and manifest as a, uh, a pseudo armor as I use creative constru uh, creative destruction to gain five temporary HP. Gotcha. Uh, it is going to be Heartbreak's turn. He continues to shout for you guys to kill it. Uh, two time. Two time. Don't roll a one on your uh, attack challenge difficulty. Uh, impossible challenge. Uh, rapid shotting, so I'm gonna get three. Uh, one, two, three. No ones, or yeah, no ones. Just twos don't misfire, thankfully. Wait, twos don't misfire? Uh, no. Pretty sure they don't. How are you reloading? Do you need paper shard cartridges? No, I have a. Uh... I technically don't even need those. I have a uh, rapid reload. Rapid reload is enough. Yeah. Rapid reload it takes for... it from a move action to a. Uh... No, it takes it to oh. a move action. And then I also have. Uh, I'm pretty sure black powder. I can reload it as a move action, and it takes a move action. I no. thought. I, okay, no, no, no. no you need to use paper cartridges for the. Uh, oh, I use paper cartridges, yeah. which increases it by one shit. Okay, so that puts it in a swift oh. action. So your second attack is gonna jam. Just fire my gun again. Yep. Uh. Which leaves it barely standing. Uh, sleepy. It is your turn. Uh. Heavy needs to stand up. You cannot heal me attack. enough to stand me back up in a single turn. Oh. Thanks for the vote of confidence. K 
Can you heal 23 hit points with a single heal? Uh, let's see if I technically can. That wouldn't be enough. You need 24. 24. Uh, so 16 plus my caster level 6. You yeah. Two on a max. Okay, then never mind. Yeah. I mean, it can still I... try to kill me, but I feel it... like. So is this blind? I, still uh, don't know. I don't think so. But it's an undead. It doesn't work by normal rules. It seems to be able to see people. So, here's a question I have for you, Gabe. Yes. Can I cast that so that a barrow haze, by the way, uh, so it's so that way it's like super low to the ground, or if I can cast it super up high and have him just be his head in it? Sure. Uh, the ceilings are a good uh, forty feet up, so you can cast it like in the air. So that way, it's like his uh, chest is. Cover it, so the, still see him. The, yeah, the top five feet. So it'll basically be five feet off the ground, essentially. Yeah, so everyone can still see him. Yes. And but they can only can see him. his leg. Is it? Which doesn't matter, I don't think. <laughs> I think you we know that we can aim more or less in the same spot. Yeah. Yeah, so I'll I'll do that. Take that. Go down this haze. And uh, that's a 20 foot radius. I need to draw that. Uh, radius? Yes, yeah, 20 foot radius. Uh, while you're drawing that, we're going to move on to Heavy's turn. <laughs> Yeah. You are not unconscious. You're not dying, I should yeah. say. I am very unconscious. Did someone just die? No, that's that's <laughs> that heavy snoring. Okay. Apparently you're not very good at roleplaying because that because you're not dying. <laughs> okay. Uh, so that's heavy turn. Last now, what are you gonna do? Uh I will find a step. You've been attempting to gravel this thing, but you have not rolled above a 10. To I have not rolled above a 7. Punch him dead. Oh, but the punching is worse. But he's almost dead. But is he? Yes. Yeah. Alright. I will unarm strike. Um. I'm sorry, I, mean, I keep forgetting. Okay, no, if you, I mean, okay, don't, sorry, if you want to grapple, grapple. I'm not trying to play your character, I'm sorry, I realize I do that. And I'm trying to. What are you going to do? you going to grapple or so, play? So, I, I keep forgetting with uh, Pathfinder, BAB, a plus five, I get two, I can do two. No, plus six. Levels. Plus six. Well, I'm, yeah, I'm plus six, so. Yeah, so it should be. Uh, I believe you can, a but you only, you only you only have uh, full BAB when you're grappling. You don't yeah. have it for other things. Oh, because he's not an unchained monk. Yeah. yeah, so he would only have one attack at this level plus another one from flood right? Yeah. So what level do I have to be to have two attacks as a un or a non unchained monk? Uh, eight level. What the fucking bitch? You're you're a grappler. You I know. Don't listen to the idiots. Yeah. You Don't will worry. pass this grapple. Let's go. Beautiful. <laughs> this dude's a fucking grapple. He only has uh, a CMD of 29. Only. <laughs> you were so only close. Fucking... And That's I still strange. only rolled a 10. <laughs> uh, I, I know how you, you feel. understand like that he is entangled. That's why he has this little too. Uh... uh he is going to get uh, grabbed by you. Uh, so you're now grappling him. His attacks are going to be much worse. 
Uh, your four damage does not get through his DR, cool. but he is grappled. Uh, you maintain that... the grapple the turn that you make it if you have greater grapple? No, you can't. No, okay. that's to maintain and starting a grapple. Yeah, grapple. basically you can maintain on one and then start a new grapple. Okay, so you couldn't, like, try to advance the step of grappling until next turn? No, yeah. Uh, it is going to be uh, Yao Hua's turn. Alright, uh, Yao Hua will pass as per usual. Uh, the Gold Daku is going to realize it uh, doesn't have much time left alive, and its goal is to protect this area. Uh, so it is going to attempt to blind some people permanently. <laughs> Again. So it's going to release its breath, which it regenerated last turn, on heavy and two time. Make two more fourths. <laughs> Damn it. Oh, no. oh, heavy. Uh, you guys watch as this breath enters uh, this area around two time and heavy. It's like gray mist. Uh, heavy's eyes shrivel and then. Oh. Oh. Uh, and it is four, and it is no longer entangled. It's However, no longer... it is grappled, <laughs> so it's basically the same penalty. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it is Tone's turn. Okay, uh, the uh, first things first is gotta make that reflex save. Uh. Uh, yep, I'm doing it. Give me a second. Uh, let's see. Uh, he's going to pass. Okay. Um, shoot. This is not good. I am severely running out of things I could do to one target. Uh, I need to get some stuff. Well, it is very damaged. Do you have anything that can do like? Yeah, do you have? Do you have? I have, like, what, I have acid one, splash. Uh, is, do you really think one d three damage is gonna make a difference? It's do not have more than energy? nothing. I suppose oh, wait, that is I, more than. Can I see what health it has because of uh? Uh, uh, uh yes. Uh, what it? What is it? What do they list? Uh, it. Is fighting off death. So alive with four or more. Four or more. This is also undead. So, yeah. Yes. Yeah. No, it's uh. Wait, never mind. It's fragile. Sorry. With three or fewer. Three so, or fewer hit points. That means. Yes, so acid splash could make the difference because I cannot roll for shit this combat. If you don't, I can hit it. I can kill it. Yeah. yeah, I I really don't. I have I'm I'm running on fumes. Just here. acid splash it. I don't have acid spat. Uh, Do you I have believe, any damage cantrip? I, I believe wizards you only allowed to have a certain number of cantrips prepared at once. Yes, you them? are. <laughs> um, but you, what cantrips do you have prepared out? Uh, none that deal damage. Yeah, that's smart. You should. Uh, I can. Uh, oh shoot, it has resistances though, so. I have I have the guaranteed stone call damage, but I don't know if that's gonna that's that will hit all of us. I will. Yeah, yeah, it's not gonna it's not gonna do it. So is yeah. that your turn? I oh. unfortunately I think I'm gonna have to uh, I think I'm gonna have to pass. Heartbreak continues to just go like, hey, go go get it, fucking kill it now. Seriously, go, dead. Go, go. Kill, kill, murder, death. Uh, it's two times turn. Uh, let me make sure I can. This. Yep, I still have one grip point left after this, so my shit still functions. Uh, I can spend. Da, 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 da. As long as I have one, so I can still shot on the run. If I do that, I'm gonna quit clear and I'm gonna take one shot again. Shot on the uh, run. I don't care about rapid shot. Uh, I don't care about deadly aim because at a bare minimum, I deal plus eight, which means even through DR. If it reduces it to five, I should deal enough to kill it, assuming I hit. 29 is gonna hit. Uh, you Bang. 14 points of damage. You get 
through its DR, and you kill it. Oh. Uh, a bullet blows through uh, its uh, leg, and it collapses down, uh, and its skull cracks against Heavy's armor. <laughs> Yay! Killing blow, okay. ellipses, question mark. Uh, and with that, it is dead. So to clarify, does Sleepy have the ability to cast, uh, what is it? Um, remove blindness? I do not. Okay. Uh, Vancid might. Uh, well, regardless, Heavy is still asleep. Yeah. Oh, I'm supposed to get you up. Kinsen is going to stand up. Gonna walk out and he's say, Oh shit. Is he dead? What's so heavy? <laughs> no, he's oh, just, never mind. Uh, not dead. Not dead. Oh, oh I thought you meant the Yeah, he's alive. That was fucking terrifying. We need to get the hell out of here. There's more of those fucking things. Where is Lorente? Uh yeah, he will. Uh, he's going to say, uh, uh, Lorenti, uh, she, oh, shit, she went through there, and I'll point over at this, uh, wall. Hey. Uh, do, do I, do we go with them? That's, uh, a wall? Uh, yeah. Oh, it's a, it's a secret door. And and or, uh, here, uh, he's just... gonna walk over, uh, and he's gonna point at this uh, thin stone panel bearing uh, the image of a three-eyed cyclops. You mean a triclops? You literally made that joke when I described that map that had that symbol on it. <laughs> You mean the triclops? Great joke. It's a way to steal my bit. Uh, how did you get separated? Man, I... Look, I... This place... This is fucking terrifying. And... I think I think I was knocked unconscious. We fought that thing. I mean, we did a bit of damage to it, but it knocked me out. And apparently, Laurenti and Laurenti and Creed left me behind. I don't want to be here anymore. This place is not safe. Yeah, I. Well, I suppose. Maybe. Maybe things would have gone smoother if you uh, didn't leave the fucking people who've been helping you this entire time behind. Your butt over there says otherwise. It wasn't just one of those things. Well, it is. Uh, we have no. We have no uh, quarrel over you if you don't want to. If, if you want to leave, we can. We're close to the entrance. We can see that we can give you safe passage. I would appreciate that. He does. Thank you. I mean, we uh, we can't take another one of those things. Not with heavy on his ass. And Honestly, you guys interest. should not go in any farther. I don't want you guys to die. I always liked you. <laughs> I don't want you to get yourselves killed in there. You think it's hopeless? Captain has to come out sometime. I don't think the captain's coming out of there. Yeah, well, sounds like then there's no shame in taking a rest. Either she comes out or she left us and she dies in there and we clean it up, I guess. I mean, I... Maybe it's, it's true that he's in a bad position. Perhaps Doc would be able to... 
not familiar with ancient Aztec Pokemon. But I'd best match that. Dog can't help him now. Dog's a natural healer, but right. that ain't something no natural healer can heal. His eyes oh, literally man. pop. Oh, it's, it's awful. Yeah. You don't have any. Do you have any healing that you could give, or you? I tapped out. Shit! Let me look at my sheet. So, Gabe, <laughs> is this is this just a way that you're flavoring it, or is it literally? Like, uh, you are permanently blind. Yes, what I'm asking is because the specific text of remove blindness and deafness is the spell does not restore ears or eyes that have been lost. Uh, it is... You're, they're shriveled up. They're not actually popped. Okay. <laughs> Your eyes are dehydrated. <laughs> Your eye drops. <laughs> Dry eyes. Just drink some water, my guy. Eye drops. Are you tired of this happening to you? <laughs> uh, he's going to walk down uh, and he'll cast Tear Light Wounds three times. On me? Yep. Uh, How many? Yeah. Oh, I need to... It's probably been a uh, minute, so I need to roll my... 20... 25 health back. I should probably and roll my disease can... shit, right? Yes. You get hit by the sick. What is the disease? Should I, do I get another save uh, now or to, no? Uh, you need to make another save, but then you're also going to take some damage. Uh, Heavy, also, if you 25. want, you can, we'll save that, and I can try it again if you succeed. Sure. Let me see what that damage is. Uh, it is going to be three strength and four dex damage. Five. Damn. Uh, and I need to put these in as debuffs, right? Yeah. Uh, 25 fails. Uh, 25 will pass. Uh, so he's got his first success and he won't be affected by it the next day. But. I, um, you don't have restoration or anything, do you sleep? No. Uh, Perhaps. I can curse you to be better, maybe. <laughs> Probably not, though. Perhaps. Perhaps we should retreat to the retreat to the ship, or at least no, outside no. The uh, two time and I should head back, but maybe Henson. But there's you need to press on. If we just abandon the captain, we're no better than. Oh, well, yeah. We I should could just. We should at least try to do the job we're hired for. Yeah, I'm not, we, our plan is to launch an escape. I I'm think not, is the plan. I'm not dying for her. I... I plain and simple. I'm not... I'm not dying for somebody who left me behind. I don't oh, care if sure. that means I'm not finishing the job and I'm a coward and I'm running. It ain't nothing new to me. I'm not dying for this. Hey, look. Nobody really understands fully why the captain does things, but if you want my two cents, she wasn't just doing it to keep you out of you know, killing us and taking our stuff. She also did it to protect you. She knew that this place was going to be dangerous. Apparently she didn't tell me about that, but... I think she likes me, you more than I do. And then she likes you more than she likes me. She definitely likes you more than she likes Creed. But it don't, it don't make no sense for her to come in here with a threat to her own life. Maybe she intends to die. What good is that, running us all around just to commit suicide? Regardless. Your time and I aren't in fighting shape. We need to get back. I definitely need someone to escort me. I can't see at all. I mean, honestly, I can fight. I'm much worse at it, but in terms of HP, I'm basically full. Yeah, and I assume this passage is the secret passage you showed us, like, not tall, and it's small. No, it can fit 
massive creatures. Oh wait, yeah, that's right. Because these people are massive. Forgot. My bad. Uh, I want to say that I can sneak myself and do and try and run uh, like a get the hell out of here kind of job. Like be casting like barrow haze everywhere, having a smoke cloud around us, being invisible, being super stealthy, and just say, "Get the fuck out!" Bye. Uh, up to you. I'm. Hens is gonna say, "You guys shouldn't go in piecemeal." Yeah. If I, I think. I, I I agree. I think three of us going in is definitely not going to help our chances. Can, can we... Between the potions we got on all of us, can we get Heavy back up to fight in shape? I can donate whatever uh, It's have. not a matter of my health, it's a matter of I can't fucking see. Yeah, it's fuck. Well... It must be. Do you have the less does he have for me to find this? <laughs> Uh, you can make a knowledge check if you want, Sleepy. Uh, of what kind? That would be just a knowledge. Uh, make a intelligence check. Sorry, not a knowledge check. Uh, there's probably stuff here. In fact, you haven't really looked around. Yeah, that's a good point, actually. I mean, we haven't they... looted the room. If they, if they, if if they created their the uh, eternal guardians to, with the power to remove someone's sight, then they probably have the magic to restore one's sight too, wouldn't they? I mean, seems I'm pretty no... fucking dumb to keep it in the same place. Though. It's worth a shot. I mean, the captain might have betrayed us, and I don't want to die for her, but I also don't want her to die. So. If it's treasure you want. It's okay. not treasure. I it's Would I be able to sorry. We should all leave. We just shouldn't stay part of us here. Um I'll chime in and ask uh what's his face? I don't even know this bro. Uh I'll ask him <laughs> what's on the, the south side of the temple since we came here first. Oh, it's some tomb with like is what that thing came out of. So you opened a tomb? No, we didn't open a tomb. We walked into a tomb. This whole place has tombs in it. What did the tombs look like? Like a tomb? Or like a, you know, like a coffin? These things? These things? Yeah, was it only... It was a hallway. Uh, I opened into a chamber. Uh, with two diamond-shaped alcoves. Stairs led into a smaller room in the back of the chamber, containing a stone table without any chairs. The northwest and southwest, southeast walls each held an alcove with one of those statues in it. And where did this thing come out of? That thing had hid under our sight line, uh, behind the table, and attacked us. Struck Hinson pretty, uh, not Hinson, uh, Vancid pretty bad. Cracked him, cracked him across the skull. And then he, you know, took me out pretty quick once I started singing. Uh, maybe, and there was more of these guys? I mean, I heard a lot of movement. I didn't see any more. I got a feeling there's more. Uh, you could go ahead and give me a sense motive. These are undead, right? Yeah. Can I use... Okay, so we know that stepping out in this general area is okay. Mm -hmm. Can I use my ghost vision gloves to see them? Uh... It only is going to pass through five feet of stone. 
Yeah, that's true. It might, it might be nice if maybe me and Sleepy, because I'm fast and he's sleepy, I, yeah, I go can, in and kind of check it out to make sure it's safe. And then we can go investigate to make sure that there's no potions back there, because that seems like a, a... If it's a tomb, it's, you know, noteworthy. Yeah. Also, there are sense motives. Get anything or not. Oh, I'll uh, yeah. I had an 18 on mine. Uh, the 21 is going to get that he is... Uh... He's not thinking rationally. Like, this guy is... He's out. freaked the fuck out. Yeah. And... Is he still... Is she still hurt? Because I can also heal him. If he needs it. Uh, he's... Yeah, he's still hurt. <laughs> Yeah, I'll just cast uh, healing X. Yeah, he appreciates that. Uh, he uh, he might be like freaked out, but his advice right it's now good advice. is no, it's not a good advice. Oh, it's not it good advice. Entirely fueled by that like fight or flight motion, and he, this guy leans flight. You can tell okay. that. He's a bit of a coward. Hey, join the club, buddy. Uh, uh, and I think I can go into that other temple room really stealthily. Because I can be invisible in a smoke cloud where I can see and they can't. Go for it. Find a scroll. Get back. If there's a sign of danger, uh, let us I will run. run. <laughs> we'll let us know so we can run. Yeah, I'll, I'll be shouting. Are you uh, doing anything in this chamber beforehand? Oh, I, I thought mean, we tried to search it as well. You did? One? Yeah. I mean, we, we rolled perception. I, I guess we rolled perception, so we didn't see uh, anything. Sorry. I didn't uh, actually hear you say that you were searching. No. Yeah. Well, I yelled loot the room. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> uh, so on, the, on, the body, on the body of the creature is uh, incredibly well made. Uh, like the uh, cassock, C A S S O C K. I didn't know there were Russians here. Oh, oh it's like a, it's like a road. Oh yeah, that is, isn't it? Uh, Sorry, stupid brain. And uh, it also has a staff across its back. Uh, do I... any of those things detect as magic? Detect as magic. Are uh, they both detect as magic? I can spellcraft those. Uh, yeah. Spellcraft. Or not that. Uh, you got a 26 on the cassock of the clergy. Uh, can we look that up? Yep. Uh, and a... Uh, 19 will get it, but a 28 will from uh, a staff of healing. Staff of healing? Uh, Kashuk of the Clergy is good for none of us. Uh, it's a divine focus, plus three bonus on charisma checks to influence creatures that match alignment. The staff of healing has five charges. Where may use Bless and Sanctuary each once per day and may prepare an additional Arisen, which is the, uh, the cantrip thing for clerics. If there is spontaneous Divine Caster once per day, she may spend one hour in prayer to gain an Arisen of her choice as a spell known for this one. It is not useful to your guys. Yep. A staff of healing has removed. Blindness and deafness is one of its uh, charges. How many charges. Two. Two. Please oh, fix me. Well, <laughs> the is, can anyone cast that in the party? Like, is that on someone's? Yes, list? it's on the witch spell list, and I believe yes. also the wizard spell list. Okay. Yes, I have the ability to cast it. I have not learned. I do not. Have, only witches. Does okay. not look like uh, I can cast it. Uh, so you grab this staff. Yeah. Shrinks down. To your height. The question is, what absurd way of using it do you convince Heavy is necessary? Oh god. Well, <laughs> gotta go all the way up your butt. 
It's gotta go yeah, all the way up I'm your butt. Oh, no, 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 no. Now I'm gonna go blind. I'm gonna gouge my own eyes out. I have to, like, the healing comes from the inside. Like, it kind of, like, squirts out. So oh. I gotta stick way up there and get it all basically to your eyes. <laughs> and for it to whoops, give, you, <laughs> give you your sight back. Are you ready? I mean, I... I'm still in all of my armor. Wouldn't I have to... It, it, yes, I'm ready. I... I put it uh, at his back. And I just cast it. <laughs> like, I, don't put it on, I don't put it on the top. I just want to make him freak out a little bit. Okay. He wasn't freaking out. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you're, you're oh, talking... Yeah, oh, you well, no, it's just, like, you're you're talking to a man who literally channels the power of the plane of entropy, which rips his body apart from the inside. So a little something up the butt isn't too much. <laughs> so, so he's used to it. Oh. Well, no, it's just, like, you know, it, it would be a tickle compared to the feeling of entropy and death trying to rip you apart. So I will get rid of two charges, so I have three charges, that means I have one more remove blindness, and some... Oh, lesser restoration as well! For how many charges? One. Uh, does that work? Do I get to, do we get to pick which ability that yes. reduces shit for? Uh, does it, like, the staff doesn't get destroyed when it runs out of charges, right? It does. Oh. I, but uh, you can so recharge it. It doesn't. Yeah. it doesn't. Oh, it doesn't? Yeah, that's once. You can recharge staffs by casting spells on its list of a certain level into it. But you have to be able to cast the highest level of spell before you can actually refill it. Uh, so, I ha so as long as I can charges? cast a third level spell, yeah, I can charge it. Uh, is remove disease on your spell list? Uh, let me if remove remove blindness disease. is, I assume it would be. Yes. Right? It is. Okay. Then yeah, you can recharge it if you have third level spells. Yeah. Okay. Wow. This is great. How many charges can it hold? Uh, I think it's. Because uh, I'm looking at it. Ten charges. Staffs can hold ten charges. Okay. Man, this is a fucking great find. Can yeah. I get as many charges as you can spare? Three. It, yeah, and it doesn't break. Yeah. Uh, so three. Oh, like it doesn't have a chance of breaking. Well, I it. I feel like for now we should hold on to two of them in case someone else goes blind. Yeah, I can. I'll give you one. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna apply this to my decks. Yeah. Nice. Just... Boom. Easy peasy. I am moving at 15 feet because of, I'm at two strength. <laughs> well, I can give you 1.25 times. Uh, does that matter? <laughs> it might. 1.25. Uh, damage doesn't actually affect uh, your carrying capacity. Oh, okay. Well, then I'm just gonna keep moving it. Oh, okay. Crap. Sorry. Staff odd healing. <laughs> that, yeah. Okay. Listen. Beautiful. Okay. Uh, I'm at full fighting strength then. Uh. Yeah. Uh... We're good. Uh. Oh, potions for heavy. Uh. Um, yeah, heavy heavy will drink one of his own cure moderate wounds potions. I'll give you my two cure mods. No, don't do that. You might need them. I'll give you a cure mod. Uh, people who have an open body slot, uh, the cassock, the cassock can uh do uh can give you guys bonuses. Uh, they can give you the ability to cast a bless in sanctuary. Yeah, it uh, it is a good oh, item. I assumed that you had to be able to. No, no, you get more. There, there is. I don't believe there is any magic item in Pathfinder that requires you. Well, actually, no, there are a few, but there are not many that require. Um, and this is not one of them. Yeah. So basically, uh, you just get a bonus normal what oh, you, okay. your class or what you worship okay uh i mean i it, I can, really, it, I it can works for it. sleepy uh yeah. okay you're gonna wear sleepy worship uh, 
I'm thinking I fell out of Eridan. Nope. I was... No, I got it. You can fall out of Eridan in the game. The well, I was... I was... Okay. As of right now, you worship Eridan until you are given a reason otherwise. Because you chose that trait. <laughs> Way to worship Jesus, Sleepy. <laughs> Way <laughs> to worship Jesus. Yeah, so that was that was real awkward. I <laughs> me not reading. <laughs> Classic. I give you one. Oh wait, hold on. There's cure serious wounds in this staff. It. You do not waste yep. that on me. But then we don't. Yeah, but then we. I'm have, just saying uh... I need to charge so... it because it's cure serious. Uh, and that's a fourth level spell. No, isn't cure critical for a Do you not have cure, cure critical? Oh, cure wait, crit hold on. No, it's level. not. No, wait, what am I fucking talking about? I'm looking at cure serious wounds mass. I'm dumb. Sorry. Yeah, that's, that's that's really high level. <laughs> yeah I was like, right. so yeah, I'm, I'm fine. I can, so, I, I can charge it. So right. I'm getting 4d8 plus 6 hit points, right? I also have 3. So do I. I'll get to those next. First, I'm rolling for this. So 48 plus 6, correct? From two cure mods? Yep. And so uh, what caster level is the staff, or is it my caster level? Uh, it is your caster level. Plus, uh, how the heck do I have caster? It is your class level if you are just straight witch. No, I'm just looking at my... Uh... Uh, how to like to do like at bracket caster one underscore class is what I was wondering. All right, I'll take two of my own cure lights. Uh, so that is going to be 2d8 plus two. Eight more. Yeah, I'm I'm not I'm not at full, but I'm I'm good enough. I have three cure lights if you want one. Ah, uh, sure, I'll fucking take one. I mean, I'd rather you be full because you do use health as a resource. Yeah. Okay, well that puts me up to 75 of 87. That's pretty decent. Yeah. No fucking okay. brick wall. Uh, what are you gonna do? <sighs> well, further in. I think I suppose this changes things. Yes, we uh, can press forward. No, 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 no. You can leave. I can't head back. This island has like a bunch of things on it. We didn't see any of them on the way here. Uh, no, definitely there was a lighthouse, bro, bro. See, um, lighthouses. Lighthouses are terrifying. What the uh, fuck are you talking about? It's a lighthouse. It's giant. Really it's terrifying. Yeah, the light beams out from them. Imagine if one of them had a giant flaming eye on top of it. Uh, Tone, Tone will put a hand on Heartbreak's uh, shoulder and say, We are going to go in there and rescue your captain. Uh, we are apparently dangerous enough that your captain is betraying us and leaving us behind. And you think that going outside would be dangerous by yourself. So what it sounds like is that your best course of action is to consolidate power with those who can defend you. Does that seem logical? He looks at you, eyes wide. He's going to say, well, shit, if you're desperate to get us all killed, why the fuck not die with you? There's the spirit. All right, let's let's form up and find Laurenti. I am going through a lot right now, but at the very least, we will get to the bottom of this damn place and get our answers and get out safely together. Okay. Indeed. I still think this is a bit rash, but I. What the I... hell? We're. <laughs> Let's go. 
before I change my mind. It's difficult to uh, 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 to what kind of go up to Tucson. I understand it's difficult even rationalizing it to myself, but I don't know. It feels like it feels like how I felt before was wrong. This this animosity, this anger. I don't want to be ruled by it, and for some reason this just feels better. If, if you don't is, want to be ruled by it, rule it instead. Happy will say as he walks by you. <laughs> it will be like an like actual shock. Did, That's actually like really good philosophical did, advice. If he just did, he'll like look at yeah. to, he'll look at two time. Did, did I? Yeah, did, he did. Wow. That's good advice. I mean, if you if you would have gotten to know the guy, maybe you would have realized that you know he. Maybe a little slow, but he's not a complete idiot. He says some smart <laughs> things. He says some smart things once a year. Well, well, aren't we lucky then? Let's see if that let's see if that luck continues. Well, let's go die. Okay. So, uh, you guys opening up this door? How are you gonna open up the secret door? Uh, by pressing the, the secret lever. Oh, uh, yeah, it'll open up. <laughs> <laughs> Eyes open, revealing a staircase. Oh, is um, right here? Yeah. I'm gonna make another perception check to make sure that we can follow. It was a 39 to beat it last time. See? I do not think that you were being followed. Can I light my own torch so I can have my own torch? Yeah, sure. Can you give me a torch? I was trying to There's patch you on the back, Heavy. <laughs> Hi, can I, wait, I have a question. Can I cast a Bless now? Yes, it lasts for minutes per level, and this is a caster level 1 item. So it lasts okay. for one minute. What does? Bless the from the thing. Oh. Are we... Are you spending it now? No, I just want, I'm putting it in my sheet as a spell-like ability. Okay. So that way I know I have it and can do it. Sanctuary. Yeah, sorry, give me just one minute to put that other stuff to my sheet. Per day. Ah, uh, so... Last snow. Uh, this immense hall is both grand, is both grand in scale and design. The room and attached southern antechamber measure over a hundred feet long, from north to south. A raised dais sits in the center. Uh, this right here. The raised dais. Uh, in the center of the hall, flanked by two thick stone columns inscribed with runes from floor to ceiling. Two alcoves in the uh, western wall remain dark and empty, and the northeastern corner has partly collapsed, scattering. Uh, has partly collapsed, scattering the large slabs of worked stone and piles of dense rubble across the floor. More runes similar to those on the columns cover the walls and floor. Are these like the runes we saw at the first, uh, at the gate? Uh, yeah. Uh, and as far as you can tell, they still remain uh, Cyclopean. Hmm. Um, I guess, fuck, I don't know, did I get my, my flame? No, I didn't. 
what? You get your flame? What? I thought I asked, like, I lit a torch, but I need you to oh, give okay. me sight. Oh, okay. I'll give you a torch. There we go. Perfect. Yes. You access to it. Um, I didn't want to keep waiting on the, the flaming spear thing. Um, so I'm going to relay to everybody. I keep seeing the same. I keep seeing the same glyphs that we saw on the, uh, the broken trap. So I'd watch your step. Um, oh, but yeah. there, there's a, there's a lot to see to this one. Okay. You should be able to bring that torch token with you if you want. Oh, you can no. it. Yeah, I can. Yeah. You know, Heartbreak, you know which way they went once they were in here? Yeah. I don't want to explore too much and, tr and get another one of something I didn't make it up to here, so... Okay. No. I figured, just making sure. Can you also speak, uh, this language? Yeah, I will also receive. I speak... No. I do not speak that language. And also, I am invisible and sneaking, and going to my invisible runs out, which has the dawn. A ward. Ah. <laughs> you use ward to maintain invisibility? Yes. <laughs> well, I got at least two sets of staircases on the other side, and it looks like a fountain? Messing a fountain? Two time. You're perceptioning on this room, right? Uh, yeah, I rolled a 23. Yeah, I got a 31 for my perception, too. Gotcha. Oh, we're at it. Uh, you do not see anything dangerous to you. Do we see any traces uh, of. You don't see any traces of recent combat either. Uh, you will hear, however, uh, shuffling and mumbling coming from over here, but only you hear it last snow. Uh, oh, oh only I hear in this is the correct one over here. The correct one is a... Did, no, I'm sorry, did you say it was right here? Yeah, it's right, it's right here. That is the one that I was talking about, yeah. Oh, okay. by the way, your color is black. It is. Like, uh, so it's very hard to see when... Wait, why is mine? My color pink is yellow. In the darkness. Uh, I thought my color was red, so I don't know why it's oh, black. Oh, no. No, Gabe's is. Oh. Well, Gabe mine was to black, too, so... Yeah, everyone's was black for a little bit. Yeah. Wait, where the fuck is my pink? Pink! Yeah, there we go. Now uh, the three of us are pink. <laughs> uh, well, I'm the light pink. I guess I'll be purple then. Purple! Uh, sorry, I got distracted. Click you on click the on the swatch next to your name. Yeah. Um, I'll kind of get everybody's attention and kind of whisper that I hear... Does it sound like big shuffling? No. Just shuffling? It sounds like a man. Oh. A man um, that we have heard before? Uh, well, you... I, I literally don't know no, everybody. I not. <laughs> Can I, like, focus my perception on that area if he points it out. Yeah, I'll point it out so like I hear I hear movement from someone over there. Can I reroll then... my perception with that? Oh uh, yeah sure. Great. Uh you hear the mumbling now but you can't really make out enough. Alright. Time for me to alert everyone to our presence. Yep. I'm gonna stealth to go the last ten feet. Twenty-eight. Uh, I mean, you get the feeling that they know they're there. You're there. It's just whether they uh, notice you. Oh well, there we go. Heavy is alerting them, anyways. Uh, yeah. So you uh, come around this corner and you see a injured Vancid Creed, and as you step around the corner, uh, he's going to fling a bomb. He doesn't know last. Shit. Yeah. Right, let's uh, roll some initiative. Oh, fuck. Uh, okay. Torch, six. <laughs> let's go, Talk Torch. My... Good old Vancid. Stupid son of a bitch. 
Better not be mind control. If he's mind controlled, I punch him until he falls asleep. I think you may find that he does not need to be mind controlled. He's, he's just, just an asshole. Yeah. He is just an asshole. Well, I enjoyed him. I enjoyed him. He was great. I liked him. Because well, you're an asshole. <laughs> <laughs> if he remains hostile, I will still punch him until he falls asleep. Uh, so, we got th four rolls. Uh, last no, I need your roll. I think you clicked on your uh, torch. Did I get the torch? Oh, okay. That's weird. Still rolled fucking terribly. You remain in the same place in initiative. So we're not going to bother changing it. Uh, so he's going to fling a bomb, and then uh, we'll start on initiative. Uh, that is a 22 to hit you. Uh, your touch last now. God fucking damn, 19. Uh, he does 14 points of cold damage, this bomb. Uh, and uh, you take uh, you need to make a fortitude save. Is that a AOE attack? Uh, no. Uh, if if you were around someone who got hit by it, it would be an AOE attack, but it isn't. I need you to make a fort save. I'm getting there. I'm getting there. I'm just upset at my life choices. <laughs> what the fuck's my fortitude? Where it says fortitude. <laughs> It does say fortitude, you're correct. 23. Uh, you are not staggered. Uh, this cold energy pours over you as this bomb strikes you. I, I'm sorry, but I do need the damage again. Uh, no problem. 14. 14, okay. Uh, as your snow, snowy fur becomes a lot more snowy. Uh, it is Sleepy's turn. So... You're invisible for three rounds. Great. Uh, look at, uh, like, can I see if he's under the effect of a spell and or if he is just scared? Sense motive to detect an enchantment. It is a move action if you want to do this. Oh. Would you like to do it? Uh... I feel like there's a correct option here, and... Uh, I can get the... I mean, he might be, but also he might just be an asshole. I think we'd, we'd want to be sure. Yeah, that's true. Should I put him in some cloud? I was going to say sleep his ass. I cannot do. Uh, why? Too He's far. too far away. You can't move in sleep? No. Nope. He did the sense mode. Oh, he only rolled an 11. Ah, uh, so you're doing the sense motive? Uh... Yeah... Even if you don't, okay. even if you don't do it, you still can't get close enough? Uh, yeah. You, 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 get, you get the feeling that this guy, uh, he's looking at you, and you see in his eyes, it's not someone being controlled. This guy doesn't want to share with you folks, and he sees a chance get rid of you damn okay man Sid. i'm gonna just shout i'll be like or i guess not shout if i shout out will he know where i am maybe probably uh he will he's not able to act yet but you'll get an answer soon uh okay i am going to fucking say fuck this dude i'm gonna put him in cloud any objections? Can I see him to what, kill what him? Is put him in a cloud. I'll cast Barrow Haze on him. So is it only him? Can I it, it, see it's, through it? I can see through it. Can I see through it? No. I'd rather you didn't, but... It's fine. I don't... I'm not too worried about this. Uh, okay. I am then just going to cast I mean I just can't shoot him yeah no I know I'm just gonna cast them myself 
I think we should. I think we should hold off on attacking. Yeah, that also. Uh, I will tell you what I saw. Of All right. This man. So, uh, you're gonna do what? Sleepy. Boom. Barrow haze. Yeah, Sorry, I'm. I'm hold on. I, I, this is me just for me. This is not a placement. Go ahead and place my one. Four. Yeah, I just want to make sure I have like. Uh... Oh, sorry, Tom. You're in the goat. You're in. You're in my mist. And I will tell everybody. I think he just wants the kills. I'm gonna be real. Okay, that's Sleepy's turn. Uh, he's going to say. Yes, you are right. I am not going to share this loot with a bunch of low-life mercenaries. Hold it. <laughs> uh, and then time sort of, uh, space sort of like warps around him and he moves with such speed it's incredible. He is suddenly up here. Uh, and he'll continue his movement uh, over to here, uh, where you see uh, he will drink a drink and uh, a bunch of him appear. Oh, boy. Hmm. Time to do I... my job as a multiple attack fucking guy and just clear the mirror images. <laughs> Yeah, could I could I confirm that that's mirror image? Actually, I don't think he's gonna arrive there. He'd prefer to arrive here. Oh, you bitch! And then <laughs> images. Uh, yeah, you can make a spellcraft check if you want. Okay. Whoops, that's the wrong kind. That is a 12. My spellcraft bonus is a 12, so 24. Sorry, you can't actually. He's an alchemist, okay. so he doesn't cast the spell. Uh -huh. uh, you can make a knowledge arcana to identify a spell in effect. It's 20 plus the uh, level of the spell. Okay. The, okay, I rolled a 12. The bonus to my arcana is 14. So. Yeah, you pass. Uh, he casts me your image. Okay. You actually can't see that. So you, oh. you identify that once you've emerged. The double didn't work. What have I... <laughs> like, you like, so, in a fog this crooked bulls are trying to see him through smoke? Unbelievable. <laughs> Next up, it is Heavy's turn. Uh, you saw him sprint along here. Yeah. Uh, but you've lost sight of him. So of how high up is this? So that you are 10 feet up. This block of stone is 10 more feet above that. Okay. Right. So he's 10 feet up. So do I take another point of burn? No. Fuck. Okay. If you're asking... So going like that. So it would have to be I will move up to here. And then standard action launch myself up to here. With charger plate? No, with the gravity oh, compressor. Yeah. Jump, jump. Oh, yeah. Jump. Uh, okay. And I like as it. I get up there, I'll just say, I don't think we've met. No, I don't believe we have. Sorry, it will be our last meeting. Yes, it will. 
tone. Uh, uh, can I get up to here? This is like a staircase. Yep. Okay. Tone will will walk up with his uh, will will run up with his hands raised and say, "Stop! Realize what you're doing. Knocking us out of the deal. You're not. This isn't just some. Uh, your equation is wrong. You're only factoring your own cut, but." Your actions, you're going back on an agreement between us and your boss. Would you really risk her own life for your own gain? Oh, I'm going to kill Laurenti as well. Ah, bastard. Well, uh, I suppose I this makes sense. I working for pirates. Back in Andoran, my family, we were lumber barons. We ruled. But then the fucking Eagle Knights, they took everything from us. Okay, and... And I'm gonna kill you! So true. You Grundy filth pit. <laughs> oh, okay, that's... Uh... Okay, um... Tone. Yes. Heavy, Heavy was being kind of jocular before, like, you know, I, we've got this, he's just one guy against all of us. Now, like, in a second, he has gone from confident to pissed. Uh... All right. Uh, well, Tone is going to remember to roll initiative his first bird. Uh, he is going to delay casting uh, Fireball, Bill Yao Huster. <laughs> He's going to delay casting? Yes. You're gonna ready casting a fire? Yeah, ready, ready. You know. Okay. What is it? Uh oh, uh I I Yoho's not on it's not selected when I roll. So can you put them at fifteen? Sure, yeah. Okay. Uh is that your turn? Yep, let's come yet. So he's delaying until Yahuwah's turn. Yes. Uh, two time. Uh, you said it's ten feet up here? Yep. I'm just gonna do a silly little jump. That is gonna be DC 40. Really? <laughs> yep. You can make it, though. I've seen you do it. Yeah, I know I can make it. It's just... You can also double jump as well. What do you think? Yeah, to? I'm gonna double jump. Uh, or wait, do I need to spend a grid to do that? I need to spend a grit to do that, and I only have... Or no, I got a killing blow, so I only... I do have... Man, it's like I have a class resource that goes up and down. Um, <laughs> so what do I need to roll if I double jump? Uh, I'd be 20 each. Oh, I can just... Auto-pass it? I... Well, you I can make it a Uh, okay. Yeah, so you could jump up, and then you could jump another ten feet to be above him when you do whatever you're gonna do. I guess I will do the classic, uh... Do-do-do-do-do-do... I am point blank shot, I guess I'll deadly aim. Uh, I will be ten feet above him while I take a shot, because I can only take one shot. And this will hit touch, because I'm within twenty. Uh, boop. God fucking damn it, man! Dude, oh, Did I you... can re I can reroll with black. Yeah, that was fun run, yeah. I can reload. With... I'm gonna reroll so I don't have to do it again. Hey, wouldn't that just use the second one of the? It doesn't. It, it doesn't misfire. It's it's if it's a, does a 19 hit his touch? Uh a 19 will hit his touch. Uh. Okay, so but it's gonna hit a mirror image instead. Yeah, that's probably. Uh, it's gonna be a D uh, eight. Uh, and roll an eight if you want to hit. Okay. Uh, you are going to miss with that first attack, but it does get rid of an image. Yep. And then I have to roll a seven. So on, so on, so on, so on. Okay. Uh, it is Yao Hua's turn. All right, uh, they're going to fly up. 
Uh, and then they are going to cast with familiar spell, which I've readied, uh, a second level Burning Hands. Uh, and as everything triggers, uh, I'm going to cast a elemental co-mixed fireball right there. Uh, so you see as uh, 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 Tone stomps on the ground and creates the, uh, basically like uh, pushes up this huge boulder and with another hand uh, uh, he uh, jettisons it with uh, fire and it creates this like molten slag meteor and uh, he says, you know, Creed, from the one time that we did meet, I never did like you. And he kicks it right into his face. Uh, so that is going to do uh, that. So it is a DC 21 because it has been coaxed. Uh, and uh, I'm also, yeah, and also the, the fire effect is because I uh, evoked it to, uh, I, I, I evoked it to uh the earth is uh so it's not fire damage uh I, it is yeah it's it's, uh, it's the acid damage i've changed the descriptor to, to earth okay he does seem to resist a little bit of that but he will take uh he fails the save okay uh and then he's gonna have to make another save because that was earth plus fire so I'm, uh it creates a it picks up a huge dust cloud up in his thing Oh, it actually shoot that. I think I did the wrong one. My, my bad. Okay. Uh, he has to make a he has to make a he has to make a reflex save, or uh, uh, he catches on fire. Gotcha. Uh, he will pass that one. It's twenty one. Okay. Uh, that is Yao Hua's turn. It is yep. last snow. Did I take any of his images out? No. Uh, no. Uh, it has Mirror to be image is a little silly. <laughs> specific strike against him, not an area of effect. Okay, hold on. In Pathfinder, if you get kicked in the face with a fireball, that's not an area of effect thing? No, it, no, is, it is. It, it, so it, therefore, it, it doesn't you... affect mirror images. Oh, mirror only, images in only, Pathfinder only is... Only specific, specific strikes. Which I guess makes sense, because, because uh, the there's other no way one. to tell... There's no way to tell which one got hit by the damage. Yeah. Yeah, well, yeah it's a fireball. And it's whole like mirror mirror image is already countered hard enough by AoEs. Like by the way, you... I assume I assume you didn't place it anywhere that would hit you guys as well. Please. I know. I feel like that's pretty <laughs> easy to do. Yeah. Okay, let's know. What do you, what are you doing? Uh thing I can do. I'm going to move up to there. 35 feet of movement. If I... Nope. Move my torch. There's me. Your torch um, is undeniably over there. Yeah. I guess I won't grapple since I don't know what mirror image blah blah blah. So I'll just throw a unarmed strike. Go for it. Would, would grappling would. still remove mirror images? Yeah, it would. Oh, it would? Oh, yeah, for sure. Is that because I do damage to it, or what? Well, it's because, uh, it's because your arms go around it, and then you realize it's fake. Oh, well, then I'll do that because I have the chance. Groovy. Go for it. 30. Okay. You absolutely get rid of uh, another image unless you roll a 7. Go ahead and roll a d7. Fuck do you roll a d7? Just do uh, card, d7. space, d7. Wait, do what is it? Slash R, space D seven. There we. Go. Uh, not gonna get rid of a. It will get rid of an image. Not gonna grab. You just uh, had to get in the way, didn't you? It is. I mean, I literally have one fucking thing I can do. It is Sleepy's turn. No, I mean with your positioning. Oh no, that's what he's saying. You got one thing you can do. Yeah. Like, do you want me to Real? hiss at him from afar? You want him to piss at him from afar? I want I you to be hiss. stood. I know what right. you said. Piss. I know what you said. I want you to be stood right there. Okay. Well, it is a uh, sleepy screen. Well. Uh, what's Remember, he's 20 feet up. 
great point. Uh, <laughs> a good, solid point. <laughs> how close do I need to be, then? Like, uh... Here? Uh, yeah. Here? I mean, that Here? would work. Uh... That work? Maybe be here? I don't know. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. I gotta measure it. Tell me where I can go. Can you see? I can see him, yeah. Uh, I was just... You can see through. So that's 25. Uh... You, you'd have to be one more closer from there. That's where you be one of these. Or this one. And I'm not in my cloud anymore. Yeah. So... Do I have cover here from him? Uh, yes. I would say so. You'd have okay. uh, half cover at least. Uh, so, soft cover. Like, like plus four to AC. Ooh, sounds good to me. I will try to cast my slumber hex on him as I emerge from the mist. I will kind of like grab some smoke and just kind of throw it like a harpoon right at uh, the Vincent. calf man. Calf man Jones. Fans of Creed. Post in. Calf man? Calf man? Calf yeah, man? dude, his calves are crazy. His calves are crazy, yeah, I remember. And, uh, yep, yeah, the smoke will just try and enter his nostrils and fog up his brain. Uh, he will make a will save. Yes, please. Uh, and he is going to pass. Got it. So he passes his first. You can still affect him again. Yes. Uh, that is Sleepy's turn. I'm not invisible. Uh, Vancid is going to fling an explosive bomb at Sleepy. Uh, no, uh, Heavy. Uh, so that is going to affect uh, Yao Hua, Heavy... Oh, no, I mean, mainly it's just going to affect heavy. Let's see. Let's see what it does. Let's see what it does. Let's see uh, what that, is a, do. that is a uh, 15 against touch AC. That'll hit. Uh, that will be uh, 18 points of cold damage. Okay. And I need a reflex save from uh, Tone, Yao Hua, and uh, Two Time. Oh, wow. It's got a blast radius of two. Yep. 19. Yao Hua does not have improved evasion because of its archetype. Yao Hua will take seven cold. Oh, and Tone will take three cold, as will two time. I will take uh, three cold. And then Heavy is going to take uh, 20 cold damage. In and addition? Just, no, only that. But I already took the 18. Oh. No, did you already, like, roll damage for him again? And then... 18. Oh. Let me see. He's got 18. Sorry, 19 cold damage. Uh, I forgot to apply the uh, point blank shot, and then I applied it twice. Uh, <laughs> uh, so that is 19 points of cold damage. Okay. Uh, and then he is going to uh, need to make a fortitude save. Wow. I wonder how that'll go. Pretty decent. Yeah, pretty decently. Uh, he's fine. Uh, and then... Let's see. Could keep throwing bombs. Then he cannot flee. And he likes fleeing. So he's going to flee. Uh... He's going to roll an acrobatics to attempt to avoid attacks of opportunity. Uh, here goes. Uh, I am guessing that a 17 does not beat Last Snow's CMD. No. Uh, so you get an attack of opportunity? Definitely taking. Oh, fuck. I forgot to roll. I was going to Stunning Fist. I have to do it before I roll. I oh. mean, you still crit him. 
Did it crit? Did it crit? Well, did it? Did it actually hit? Let's see if it actually hits. Roll a d6. If you roll a six, it hits. Oh my god, that's so annoying. It is very oh, wrong one. Yep. Okay. That still still gets rid of an image. I roll fucking good when it. Oh my god. Yeah. I've got a lot of players like that. Hi. <laughs> So we already moved five feet. Let's see how far we can move beyond that. Seven feet. Uh, he's going to move over to here. Uh, and that is his turn. Uh, it is Heavy's turn. Yep. Uh, making a bomb and attacking with it also provoke an attack opportunity? Uh, it does, actually. Uh, yes. Do you have... But, but last snow probably doesn't have combat reflexes. Do you, do you have combat reflexes, last snow? Nope. Okay. If you are a monk, what you are I'm a grappling a grappling monk. monk. Can you not grapple as a attack of opportunity? No, you no, you can't. No, you can trip. That's pretty cool, though. Trip. Okay. You can sunder, and you can disarm, but you cannot grapple. You can disarm as an attack of opportunity. Huh. Yeah, interesting. Oh, I'm gonna make a disarm based character. It's fun. Yeah, Elven Battle style gives you bonuses to trying to do that. So, can I just like jump down here? Yeah. And then jump down here? Yeah, be uh, acrobatics to avoid a d6 non lethal. Oh. Well, in that case, I'm gonna have to be boring, I guess. Actually. Heavy, heavy is being even less rational than usual right now. So, he's gonna fucking go for it. Kill the racist. Two acrobatics, because I'm dropping twice? Yep. Cool. So, you're gonna see, do a... Uh, Arcana? With them? Yes, non lethal in total. Can I not what? Oh, you're, you're going a different way than I thought, so never mind. Uh, yep. So All just right. switch down lethal. That's fine. And I'm gonna get to here. That is my turn. Damn. Cross great distances. Uh, it is yeah. Tone's turn. I can move 80 feet in a round, bitch. My god, he's so fast. Uh, faster than him. I guess that's because of your skull shape. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> because no, of my ear shape, something. more like. I didn't I didn't know he had levels in phrenologist. He does. He does. <laughs> he, does <laughs> he, does actually, he does actually have access to phrenology. Yeah. It's a bar the fact that that's a bard archetype is fucking like yeah, that's so myself. many different things. I expect that should be an alchemist. <laughs> Paizo is blighted. Who who did this? Um, town. Yes. Uh, I. Uh, I would like to. Ca uh, hmm. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use the stone call scroll. And I know I do a little bit of damage to heavy, but the real thing is that I turn the entire area into, uh, into difficult terrain, so you can't run away. So, will, will, will you be okay for me doing 2d6 damage to you, heavy? Yes. Alright. This is truly cursed. I gotta find this shit. Give me a second. Uh, Pathfinder 1e. Stone Call. So, Stone Call. Uh, I believe just can you see here? I just want to make sure. Uh, 
Why does? Sorry. It, it is. Sorry. It is. I just want to make sure. Specific. For some reason, it's not in. Uh, it's not in my sheet. Stone call. So a rain of dirt, gravel, small pebbles fill the area. Uh, it says it's a four. It's a forty. A uh, foot radius. I like to center that. Uh, try to basically put it all around them. It's can't transmute the rocks. That'd be pretty cool if I could turn it into uh, turn the molten molten rain. But yeah, there. You go. <laughs> a friendly fire. Oh, nothing too bad. Um, yeah. Uh, but yeah, so, so, uh, uh, sto uh, to how is this? It's stone. Man, I'm really off my game today. Uh, Tone will, uh, will, will rip a seal off of his, uh, off of his cloak, and he will, uh, tear it in two pieces. And as he does, a portal, uh, uh, manifests over the battlefield, and, uh, uh, gra gra uh gravel and, uh, pebbles. Uh, uh, bombard the area, covering it in uneven terrain. Let me just give you access to this. You can place it where you want. Wait, you should be able to control it. Oh, God. <laughs> hey, this is terrifying. See the full radius? There you go. Alright, that's good enough. Okay. So that, so that double movement to move through that now. Gotcha. Uh, that's Tone's turn. It is two times turn. Uh, five, ten, fifteen, twenty. I don't want to use my last grip point, so I suppose I will take a shot uh, my pistols range is 20 so this will be against the first range is 20 so it will be against uh, normal AC uh, deadly and point blank no rapid uh, and then uh -huh. it's a D5 D5 yep Okay. And that's me. Uh, Yao Hua. Alright, uh, Yao Hua will pass the turn. Just, just, you uh, go. Last snow. If I may let us know. Oh, yes? You could potentially ignore the difficult terrain by jumping over it. That was yeah. actually the plan. Sorry, I went to fill up my whiskey. No um, problem. <laughs> that was actually my plan to jump as close to him from this spot here. Uh, and yeah. then do the same shit I've been trying to do to him. Uh, so that would be... I mean, you could jump out to... Uh, I mean, I, mean, I have... I have so much movement that it doesn't matter how far I get, but I'm trying to get as close as possible with my first jump. Yeah, so I mean, it's a DC 25 to get right next to him. 32. Uh, and then a, another check to see if you can lower your fall damage. Is that another acrobatics? Uh, that'll be another, yeah, acrobatics. Uh, you can definitely lower your fall damage. You only take a D6 on lethal. So let's see, that is uh, three, actually. I rolled the exact same amount that you did. Oh. Oh, sorry, I thought I was rolling it. No problem. Mm -mm -mm. I keep my torch and just knows where I'm going. Well, it's perfect because you're carrying it. <sighs> yep. uh, and then I will attempt to tackle him again. Gotcha. 33, is this a d4 this time? D4 this time, if you roll 4, you got him. 
You are going to grab him around his neck, just put him in a headlock. You torch him nice. burning above your head. Yeah. Uh, and he is grappled. That is Heck yeah. very much not good for him. Yeah, <laughs> I, I would like Casters yeah, don't like being grappled. I'm not gonna yell fight. out that I finally got him. Remember, he's an alchemist. He's not a caster. He doesn't cast spells. Oh, that's true. Is uh, there no concentration? Nope. nope. No concentration. Wow. Uh, so that's last snow's turn. Uh, you got him. Got him in your hands. Got this motherfucker. Got it. Yeah, is sure. Sleepy's turn. Now, do I make him? Do I try and make me fall asleep again, or do I make us? Him it easier to hit him harder for him to hit us or I feel like it's pretty easy for all of us to hit him. Uh... I'm trying to see if I can make him fall asleep. Maybe I, I mean, can he even can he throw a touch thing if he's like can he Grapple. throw a bomb if he's grappled? Uh, no, he can't. Oh, he can't? Yeah, oh, yeah fuck, fuck that. Then. Just sleep his ass. Yeah, he needs two hands to make them off. <laughs> me, 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 me. I'm the mirror. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try and make him go to sleep as, uh, so the stone call, a random stone that was really delayed with it falling from the sky over <laughs> however it worked, and it just boom, knocks him on the head. Okay. Uh, he is not going to fail this. Uh, and he'll scream something about monkeys that might be targeted at uh, either one of you. Oh, God. Oh, oh fuck this oh. guy. Kill his ass. Uh, one of us? I'm a goddamn cat. No, not you. <laughs> oh, okay. He's talking about the black person. Oh, oh no. <laughs> Why, uh, why did you have to make him say it? <laughs> I was so confused at first. To be fair, I think I he might have had too thing. much whiskey, Rumo. <laughs> wow, it looks like Last Snow really doesn't see color. <laughs> yep, colorblind Last Snow. Uh, I mean, he is a cat, so. Yeah, I was thinking. I was thinking the Wait, two animal characters. Yeah, yeah. No, that's what I was, I was thinking. The same thing. Like, we don't, or we yeah, don't. Uh, we like don't. I'm an actual cat. No, we don't. <laughs> Cats see the different color spectrum, kind of like dogs. Oh, that's cool. Anyway, that's my turn. <laughs> uh, okay. So that is Sleepy's turn. Uh, uh he is going to. This racist asshole is going to. Draw his throwing axe and chop at you, I think? Yeah. 21 hit? It nice does. One. It does 6 points of damage. Okay. And it is Heavy's turn. Move okay. action, gather power. Okay. And net equip. I'm going to fuck this man. Hang on, I should probably take off the Henson Spire Courage. I'm going to fuck this man. <laughs> yes. So be you with, racist to with, me, will you? With him grappled, do we know which one is the real one and ignore mirror image, or is mirror image still in effect? That's so goofy. But uh, last snow. Basically, it's like last snow appears as well. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Are you kidding me? That's actually really cool because it's not like <laughs> it, it's not like oh, you're but... creating copies is that you're Please stand by while I experience I can, I can hit the real Hey! Okay. Sorry, my my uh all of my USB oh my devices gosh. decided to disconnect themselves for a second. Roll a D4. You get a four, it hits. Yep. 
Can, can you all hear me? Yes, yeah, we can. It goes, it okay, goes around and it crushes his, uh, crushes into his shoulder and like bends it down and he grunts in pain. And I am going to glare at him and I am going to say, I have hated people like you since I was fucking born. And he looks up at you and he says, uh, nothing. He just spits in your face. <laughs> and yeah, that is my turn. Tone. All right. Uh, tone. Tone is very, uh, He's he's looking over the battlefield. He is immersed in thought about this uh this nasty, nasty man. Uh I think he he can't really do much outside of splash damage. Uh so I think he probably just passed the turn. Okay. Uh, yeah, actually, you know what Tone will do? Okay. Tone will unfortunately I'm sorry, I really can't. Uh, Tone, Tone will walk down here, and can can he? Uh, if if you're inside the cloud, can you see anything within the cloud? If you're in five feet, it works like fog. But like so like if I if I'm in here, could I see? No. Okay. I uh I will it's, spend it's, my it's for you. It's for uh, he was ready in his action the whole time. He starts singing. All right. Oh, I'm, I'm inspired dark. confidence. You you've been inspired. <laughs> I've, we've okay, I, I was just I was wondering where his allegiance is lied because he isn't doing anything. I just uh, forgot he existed. You, right, you know what's funny? I was saying I should probably take off the Henson's fire courage as all of my USBs disconnected. <laughs> <laughs> off a little bit more than that. Okay. All right. Uh, I just want to jump to like here. Okay. Uh. I assume that's good enough for what I need to do, and then another check to avoid fall damage, right? Yep. Indeed. Uh, you will take no damage because you're only dropping 10 feet. Beautiful. And I am not rapid shotting. Uh, I'm deadly aimed. I am. Am I within Inspire Courage? Is it 60 feet or is it 30? Uh, no, it's infinite. As long as you can hear it and you can hear it. Okay. Uh, that is done. So I have that. I'm not rapid shotting. Point blank shot. A deadly aim. Bop. 23. 20. Against, oh, against touch. And then I need to roll. Mega D4. Nope. Okay. You're going to take out an image? Uh, and it is, it is going to be Yao Hua's turn. Which will pass the turn. Okay, it's Les Snow's turn. Uh, Les Snow, if you want, you could pin and tie him up this round. If yes, time. so it is a grapple check to maintain, which includes the pin, and then another one to tie up. Yep, so it's, both of them will be plus five. Make those both. Uh, 35, and then 20, oh, 40, and then 30, <laughs> 34, 34, thank you. And he's also going to be taking 8 damage. Okay. And I'm using the quick manacles uh, as far as uh, the tie-up. Gotcha. So... Give me just a second. Okay. Okay. Uh, gotcha. So his arms are tied up, and he is pinned. He essentially cannot do anything. The only question is, do you guys want to kill him? Uh, yes. That's Heavy's choice. I honestly <laughs> planned to before I knew he was a racist piece of shit. 
That's okay. Heavy's choice. Okay. So, in that case, the combat's over. Heavy? Yeah. Would you like to? I, I would like to kill him until there is nothing left to kill. Oh my god. He looks up at you and he's just like grinding his teeth and he says uh, a couple more awful things as you're walking over. Uh, do you coup de grace him? Yes. Go ahead and do that. Click the button. Yep. It does not appear to have gone through. Uh, Last Snow has him like in this. There we go. Yeah, he's dead as fuck. And uh, your whip comes down this like massive dark energy and it just decapitates him with bludgeoning damage. Sucks his head right off. Yep. The blow's kind of clean as well. It looks like almost like it was cut because there's so much force behind it. Good. I'll make a nice trophy. <laughs> oh, pretty dark there. Bro. Look, man. Half elves got some internalized shit most of the time. <laughs> and it's definitely worse for someone who. It's definitely worse for someone. Also, is also. Like just treated awfully by Ch- Chalaxian people because of their human race. Yeah. Like, so uh, for those of you who have not really read Heavy's backstory, um, basically uh, he was abused by his extended family because his mom was, you know, mom decided to have a kid with an elf who just came through and then left. And, you know, if, if she's going to be that friendly with outsiders, how do we know we can trust her? And we certainly can't trust the kid. Got to beat some sense into him. Yada yada. Uh, well, no, because th- this is all, you know, a little bit outside of the colony formerly known as, or the nation formerly known as Sargava. Okay. Um, so, you know, he, he grows up with that sort of upbringing. Uh starts sort of admiring and idealizing the Hell Knights, then discovers what they're, you know, sort of really about with all the unflinching law. And he's like, mm, fuck this. When he meets... And then he meets the company. And they're the only people who actually don't hate him automatically. They just make fun of him all the time for his name. Ah, uh, and with that, uh, combat is over. Uh, this man is dead. Take uh, his shit. Take his stuff. shit. Loot! 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 Take the racist stuff. I will make uh, sure pretty... I grab my uh, quick hedge manacles back, because I cannot lose those. Gotcha. But uh, he has a potion. Okay. A uh, wand. To identify the potion. Uh, you can't identify using craft alchemy unless you're a uh, an alchemist. Alchemy. Yeah, that's right. And that's unfortunate. Uh, so the potion you guys aren't sure about. There is a wand that is magical. There is a chain shirt that is magical, and he has two throwing axes that are magical. Okay. Well, my I'll do the spellcraft for the potion that we rolled the one on, and I can also do spellcraft for the wounds on the potion. Okay. Does the twenty three pass on the wand? It will. It is a wand of cure light wounds. Oh, nice. Beautiful. I'm going to take that. It has 50 charges. Oh, Holy fuck. He has a tangle foot bag, two thunder stones. Uh, and there's also the magical chain shirt and magical throwing axes. You get the throwing axes. They are plus one throwing axes, Sleepy. All right. Uh, I can do the, uh, the chain shirt. Touch. One D eight. Does the twenty six um, identify it? Chain shirt is a cloak. Uh, sorry, it is a plus one chain shirt. He also have it has a cloak. That's a very cool cloak. Yeah, it does. Uh, uh, is that better than what Tutan wears? I also have a plus one chain shirt. Ah, I have a plus one mithril chain shirt. Better. Tutan's better. Uh, the cloak is magical as well. 
Oh, is that a separate? Is that a separate? Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Shit. Uh, to clarify, a... it's not that I'm that much better at spellcraft than sleeping. <laughs> just rolling go. He's just a rolling mic. Cloak of resistance plus two. Ooh. He also has what... sixteen gold pieces. What kind what about of bonus is the Cloak of Resistance? Prep making our scroll supplies. Does that on? Well, he might have done something with it. Uh, you want to search around his belongings a little bit more? Go ahead and make a perception check. What kind of bonus is the Cloak of Resistance? I forget. Uh... Resistance bonus. Resistance bonus. Okay, so it does stack with my halfling shit. And what? Sleepy and Two Time will find a hidden compartment in his boot uh, oh. that has a uh, beautiful gemstone in one of them, and then the other boot it is uh, thirty uh, platinum pieces. Oh shit! I will spread the platinum pieces around accordingly. There are five of us, right? Yeah, so six each. Three. Four, five, so six platinum pieces each. The gem is a flawless ruby. What caster level is the caster level one? Okay. Uh, flawless ruby. Oh, it's a cloak of resistance plus one. I'll take the thunderstones. Did I say plus two? You did say plus two. It looks like a plus two in the uh, thing, but when I copied it over, it says plus one. Oh, I just needed to zoom in a little bit. <laughs> the one uh, looks exactly like a two from where I was standing. Sell the throwing axes, I assume. Well, we sell uh, stuff later, and also probably... Yeah, no, no, I'm... The, yeah. We might want to redistribute some of it to the rest of the crew. Yeah. I'll take the tango foot bag as well. Yeah, if we're trying to make allies on... Uh... From I mean, the crew already likes us. Betrayed. The crew yeah, already likes us. To make them like, well, I don't know anybody of the crew, so from the I'll, outsider. Yeah, I will chug down. But you the... all just got betrayed by a whole fucking pirate crew, so I'm we thinking. We got betrayed by the captain. And uh, he apparently betrayed well, is only one interpretation well, you of the situation. Well, you got betrayed by Vincent as well. Yeah. Yeah, but Vincent was an asshole. Also, I'll be like, man, I'm a judge of character. And... Sleepy <laughs> will just whisper back to himself. Just like, that you're a poor judge of character? <laughs> yeah, because I really liked him. <laughs> Heavy, <laughs> Heavy is why. also going to chug down, like, just tip back his flask of alcohol with the uh, Void Spirit Stone in it to remove the point of his burn. Got it. I still have the non-lethal, but... It should be able to heal, be healed if you remove the burn. Yep, I can heal it, but I still have it. Well, you just got to cure a wound with 50 charges. Yep, please do, 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 do. Everyone's at full. <laughs> <laughs> My next thing was going to look at you is like, dude, I need you to heal the fuck out of me with that thing. Well, you know, I just, you know, I just got this. I don't want to. I think it'll be fine. The, the blade solidifies in Heavy's hand. <laughs> Oh, two time puts his two time puts so his hand right. on his gun. Heavy, you are, oh my god, you guys, you know, I am below. Half. We're fucking hurting. Dying. Okay. Oh, get. <laughs> Crit <laughs> heal. <laughs> Whoa. Heal me, baby. It oh, is a touch attack. It is a, it is a crit. Just saying. You can't crit with healing. You can't crit with it. You can't crit with it when you deal damage, though. So I'm dead. Uh, I do have a question. If I yeah, use to cast cure light wounds, can I use my full action thing to do it at a range? Uh -huh. This one. You yeah, you can do it with that. Okay, cool. I just wanted to double check. Uh, so all of these will be on heavy f at first. So okay. heavy, tell me when to stop. Keep going. 
Keep going. I'm there. I'm there. Oh, God. What's going on? Uh, what time so, is it? <laughs> Dear God. Last snow. You're up next. Yep, yep. All right. Keep going. Keep going. Is that another five? Keep going. <laughs> Damn it. Uh, One more. I'm good. Okay, hit me. Uh, <laughs> uh hit me. Uh, hit me. Dude, why am I so fucking bad at this? Uh, I'm good after that, I think. I'm good enough. Uh, can I do math? That is, yeah, I'm only three off, so I'm good. Man, that's 12 charges. Man, you uh, no, you can just... <laughs> that's what we were saying. No, yeah, we weren't. You did 38? No, he... he I just... did 12. Oh, okay. The way you just did that is very... <laughs> yeah. Yeah, why did you do it like that? <laughs> what do you mean? Why did you roll You did 38? the math wrong. You, did, you, you had already done the math. Yeah. <laughs> Why would you do it like that? <laughs> what the because fuck? Because I just, I clicked down. What is time? Oh my oh god. god. <laughs> Wait, that doesn't make sense. What do you mean? How did I mean, You did the I math mean, in his head. I did the math in your head. I mean, the, and then the way he did us. the math was right. He's like, okay, I did 12 charges. <laughs> Pretty minus the charges he didn't use. I mean, uh, I'm confused. Clearly. <laughs> Why did you subtract long. 38? Because why do you, you subtract the 12 left. that you use? But why? How do you know that's how many you have left? Because I have a little ammo count that I had set at 50. So, and after I clicked it, I decreased it by one. So why did you roll? Because I wanted to see how many times I just cast it. And one <laughs> 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 what? Nothing. <laughs> you're, just, you're, you're just you're just the real life happy as all. You, you had an ammo counter and you still rolled the calculator. Well, I wanted to see how much I just used. <laughs> We literally, are you telling me that we collectively as a party cannot roll a 1d8 like five times that is collapsing? Pretty much. <laughs> In any. Wait, can I charge a wand? No. No. Okay, the wand. I, I could charge I thought you could charge it, but I forgot that wands aren't saves. Liars. I, I mean, a liar, and it was me. Liar. Liars. I hate you. I hate you. Anyway, Donald. Thank you. Uh, well, who's written down the other stuff? Well, it is it is ten. Yeah, I need to sleep for tomorrow. definitely eleven Andy. for me. <laughs> yeah, wow. yeah. It's whatever time it is for you, fuck. <laughs> okay. It's ten for me. Fucking chill, dude. Well, I gotta be up in five hours, so. We done done? We done done. Okay. We done. Good done, lord. Done. We all Thank we God all we lost our minds staff. at the end there. Yeah, dude, that staff is huge. It, yes. RPG horror stories DM brings phrenology into the game. <laughs> I didn't I didn't bring phrenology into the game. Paizo did. Paizo did. <laughs> yeah, like uh is he gonna get like a Plus one competence bonus against uh, people he's racist towards or something? No, it's a morale bonus. That's what if he's a. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I, I, built, I, built, I built the perfect dwarven racism. I, 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 I've, yeah, set yeah. I've set it out perfectly. They get the most buffs, they get a plus 10 against orcs. That's fucked up. They fucking hate orcs so much that they can kill them so well. It's a it's a dark thing I've done. Yeah, that's uh, <laughs> one way of putting it. I've made something monstrous.
Okay. I would love to stay in chat, but I haven't eaten and I need to go to work tomorrow. So I should. Oh, you, you, you eat, you sleep, you work. That's my life. Eat, sleep, work, D and D, repeat. Pretty much. Except this is my only game going on right now. Rip. So right now it's eat, sleep, game, repeat. Eat, sleep, Overwatch, two, repeat. I hate myself. Oh <laughs> I don't. Welcome to life. Yeah. Overwatch. Um. Speaking of things that make me very sad. <sighs> exactly. I, I'm gonna. I, I think I'm gonna leave. Call. Good night, guys. Sorry. Sorry, I was so zonked today. I don't know. What I think I'm just emotionally spent because my internship's over. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I'll see you. I'll see everybody later. Yep. Uh, yeah. All right. Well, that was certainly a time. <laughs> oh. oh, there we go. Dark backstories are dark. Yeah. Well, next time, hopefully things won't get that dark. Hopefully, we'll manage to save uh, the captain. Hopefully she'll fucking believe us about having to kill him because he was planning on killing her too. But, you know, we, we, you never know. So, yeah. Thanks for watching. And I will see you all. Bye.